For sure, for sure. Let's get into the Digimon, guys, because we're doing a bit of traveling to start the day off today. We'll do we'll do Big Jack for a second while we chat nonsense and get started here. So welcome back, everybody, to episode eight, perhaps. Episode six, seven. This will be episode seven. I should stop bringing up the numbers because after one, two, and three, it gets hard to remember. But anyways, welcome back to the playthrough of Digimon World 3. We have some exciting news to share with you guys. We have done a bit of grinding. So if anybody's coming from the last part of the playthrough and is now watching the next episode, this one here, you might be confused as to why our Digimon are a little bit stronger. Let me take you guys on a mystery tour and explain where we are, what we're doing, and how strong our Digimon are, because the last time I left you guys, we were at this inn on Snow Mountain, but our Digimon were not nearly as strong. Now, everybody who has been watching the live streams over the last few days will know what's happening, but for those that are watching the YouTube VODs, maybe years in the future, or a couple of weeks in the future, or even just catching up, because they're a couple of days behind, you guys will be a little bit confused, so let me show you guys some stuff. You can see here, guys, that we've got a lot of cool stuff going on and a lot of big changes from the last time we played. Agamon is now up to level 36, as you can see. I think he was like level 32, 33 the last time we left him, something like that. He obviously still has access to Black War Greymon, Metal Greymon, and Skull Greymon. Mostly, but you'll notice that Black War Greymon is all the way up to level 80, which is pretty strong. Monmon, on the other hand, is now up to level 40, and he has access to his ultimate, at long last, Canon Dramon, which is level 1. Uh, Renamon is not quite at 40 to get access to her Mega, which will be Sukuyamon, but she is very close, and in the meantime, she has actually unlocked a Mega, which is Rosemon. Rosemon's level 5. Now, Rosemon's not exactly as important as Canon Dramon is for Monmon, because it's not her mainline, but still... Having access to Omega is very cool. So in the meantime, until we get Sukuyamon, Renamon's going to be using Rosemon and leveling that. So pretty exciting stuff. Uh, the reason I was leveling Metal Greymon as opposed to Black War Greymon and using him is just because, again, I didn't want to level Black War Greymon too much. But that being said, I'm probably going to swap it back around and we'll just get Black War Greymon to level 99. And in the meantime, Agamon can just gain levels anyway. We're going to be traveling back down to Asuka, as I mentioned. And in order to progress with the story, we need to take our four gym leader cards that we have obtained um, back to Lisa and ask Lisa where we need to go next because honestly, I can't really remember. Every single time I tell you guys that we're going to be going somewhere, sometimes it turns out that I'm wrong. So I'm just going to stop telling you guys where we're going next and uh, let you see for yourselves. Frigimon kind of kind of dunking on us here. Uh, let's try Canondramon and see if he's any stronger. These um, Megas will be strong at the moment, but they'll be stronger when they get their new moves. So we're just going to be doing moves that um, are attacking in ways, using abilities that make the most sense against some of these enemies. As you can see, the, the enemies around this, this area are still very strong, which is exactly why I wanted to stop and grind. But um, we've got a lot of TP saved up, and we're going to be spending that today when we go to the North Sector. So Renamon, for example, has 10 TP saved up, which is not a lot. Monmon has 30 TP, which is a lot. And Agamon, I think, is roughly the same. He's got 25. So the boys are going to be in catch-up. Renamon's got a little bit to spend. Uh, but again, Renamon levels up much faster than the other two. And we're getting her to 40 soon. Anyway, so... Let's go on a little adventure, guys. We're going to go back down. Back through the Amaterasu. In fact, not even Amaterasu. We're going to go back down through the dig area with Drillmon. Digmon. And we're going to be going back to regular Asuka. One thing I want to point out is some of these dig holes that are around this area in the north sector, we did actually have a little bit of exploration around while we were grinding. We didn't go too far into any of them because we didn't really want to progress again with the story. I didn't want to advance when we didn't have the recordings rolling. But we did actually discover a couple of dead ends with some items. That's where we got our metal chip from. And that's also... Um, we also had a bit of understanding about some of these dig areas as well. Some of them led to areas that we have now got access to. And as long as I can remember which takes me where, it should come in to help us in the long run. So, worth contemplating, guys. Just a bit of um, just a bit of understanding and hopefully something that will speed up the playthrough and make it a little bit more enjoyable for you guys to watch along the way as well. We are going to be going down this path here, I believe. And as long as we stay true to the southwest direction, I think we should end up in the right spot, he says. Boldly. Renamon? I think. Oh gosh, this is where things get a little bit dicey. We might have a split in the path here, I'm not entirely sure. We're looking for a little hole in one of these next few loading screens. If we can find that, then we're good to go. I'm not entirely sure that path looks like it connects round. The question is, do we go up or do we go down? I don't think that's the right way, guys. I'm going to go down into the left, and if it's wrong, we'll try that path as a backup. 
And uh, if that one's wrong, then we'll just blame Dumpster. A bit tricky, but fun. Yeah. Okay, maybe there should be a little Digimon along here telling us... Yeah, Patamon. There we go. I think this is the exit. I think this is the exit in Asuka's North Badlands. Wait, that's not where I thought we were going to go. Maybe I'll go up and north and return to Asuka's North Sector. Wait, what? Oh! Okay, we definitely, we've definitely went the wrong way. Where the hell is this? We're in the, we're, so we're in the Oasis, but we're in Asuka, which is not bad. Oh yeah, in the Dum Dum Factory, right? I think we're kind of close to where we need to be. This is not what I planned for, but do you know what? I'll take it. We must have had to have went another kind of southeastern way to get to Plug Cape, I would guess. But this will do. This is just fine, actually. Um... We could even potentially hit up the training gym, but I'm going to wait and see if, like I said, we want to go training gym in a Matarasu, I think. I'm going to go in and try and talk to Lisa in the admin department of Asuka here. And if that's not correct, then we'll figure out where to go next. But I'm pretty sure Lisa is the go-to. Now that we have Digmon and all of the cards available, which is from defeating the four gym leaders, we should be able to potentially access the real world or something. I, I don't honestly know at this point. I'm lost. We've been playing this game solid with very little distractions in between, but I don't really know what's happening right now. We'll find out when we speak to Lisa. I'm sure she'll give us an update. But Fracting, as for changes in the game, we've talked about this a lot. I think just um, having some more fast travel points and autosave function, maybe even some new Digimon packs at the beginning would be cool. We talked about last time we discussed the idea of having like a classic mode versus like a, like a revamped mode. So you could play, like when you boot up, let's say you boot up a Digimon World 3 remaster. The first thing it should ask you at the start when you click new game is, would you like to play classic, which is this version? Or would you like to play, like, you know, a reimagined version, which is basically the exact same, but with some tweaks. And then that way the people who wanted the absolute old school version, this version, could play that. And then people who wanted the new stuff could get it. Um, just as an idea, and then that way everybody would be happy theoretically, but... I think like having more Digimon packs at the start would be cool. Maybe having a mode where you could just uh, build your own pack from the Digimon available. Let's say they give you 15 rookies and you could pick three to build your own pack as like a for fun chaos mode or something and play through the game that way would be really fun. All right, we made it. This looks good. This looks like progress. Lisa, AOA's got the Juggernaut. The Juggernaut is the name of the giant ship I was trying to remember the name of earlier. A giant ship launched in the real world, I believe. It looks like it. Teddy noticed it and told us. We can tell the AOA's moves with this computer. Well, thank God, Teddy. What else have you got up there? I can also order a pizza. Do that, Teddy. Do that now. What? Now what? The Juggernaut is so powerful. It's the world's most powerful weapon, says Nick. That's why it was sealed away, so it won't be misused. Can we stop it somehow? Before it launches the nuclear warheads? Colonel! We should ask, uh, we should go ask her, um, we should go ask her, okay. Her? I'm assuming she means the games, the game master. What? Keith and Nick, you stay here with Teddy. Okay, Wolfie, let's go. I don't know where we're going, but we'll find out very soon. Oh, here she is, in the prisons. The AOA game master and all this shenanigans locked away here. Lisa, do you mean the game master? <laughs> I think it's safe to say she means the Game Master, yes. No, I meant Ronald McDonald, you idiot. She's the only person who can go to, uh, we can go to, right? Oh no, look how desperate we are now. What do you mean? Talk. I have no intentions of helping you. Oh, really? Hmm. I was going to give you up. And let you down. And desert you. I mean, what? What are you saying, Lisa? They're got, they've got the juggernaut, so nothing we can do. And I don't want to die yet. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> What? We all we fought all the way here. I don't want to. I'll never give up. Naruto Uzumaki, 2024. Wolfie, you're a straight kid. You don't know that, Lisa. You can't determine. My, you can't determine that. I'll decide. But you'll just lose your life. Wait, what? You're smarter than you look. I'll have to change my mind. Yeah, but are you smarter than a ten-year-old? Yes. The juggernaut belongs to the AOA. Only the president and Amaterasu can stop it. Oh, there you go. Where does he live? Let me guess. In the north of the desert. Not the north sector, surely. You really heard that, Wolfie? Yes, ma'am. That's what you meant. Uh-oh. 
Oh, what did I say? That was the secret. I'm such an idiot. Baited. They say first fool your allies before an enemy. Oh, so Lisa lied to me here. Lisa lied in front of us to try and get the the, the game master to bait and reveal the secrets, which obviously she did. It's like a James Bond scheme when he's tied to the laser and the bad guy reveals all the plans and then he escapes the laser and then loses, you know. Or James does. Anyways, how was my acting? Amazing. 10 out of 10. Teddy. Teddy's like, yes, I was acting like an idiot this whole time as well when I'm actually smart and useful. Okay, Teddy, yeah, sure. Sure, bro. Venmon was transferred onto the Juggernaut. Not Venmon. Not the guy who heals. What? What happened? Really? Uh-oh. Are we getting a cutscene? Oh, <gasps> Movies. Yo, Elkowal. How's it going? Elkowalski. Welcome to the stream. They're trying to kill the Juggernaut with bombs. It's a pretty cool cutscene. Shame that none of the kids playing this game would ever see it. Woo! I think he's digivolving chat. He's fighting back. There's something unhinged about that animation. And that's the entirety of the Digimon World 2003 budget. That's why we can't get an autosave. Then Destromon should be born about now. Oh no, Destromon, that'll be him then, is it? What's what's this Destromon? It's a Digimon born by fusing Venmon. Vemon? I keep calling it Venmon like that's an N, but it's, it's not an N at all. It's Vemon. And the Juggernaut. Vemmon. The big V. Destromon is the strongest Digimon. No weapon can defeat it. We've got no time to lose! Let's get the president of Megami to stop Destramon. Yes, ma'am! Alright, cool. So where does the president live in? Did we get to know? This is where we have to pay really good attention, guys. This is why I can't I can't stray my eyeballs from the screen for more than one second, because see if they tell me exactly where to go and I miss it, we're doomed. But the question is how to get inside a Matarasu city. It's the AOA's headquarters, so the security is tight. That's true, if we can get someone to help, dot dot dot. That's impossible, everyone's turned into Oinkmon. I mean, come on, look around. Mm, help. We're having a think, we're coming up with a plan, we're saving the game, saving the world. Oh yeah, Kenny was saying something about... Alright, I'll go to a Matarasa server again to look. Please tell me, I've got more than that. Please tell me. Thanks, I'm counting on you. No, but there has to be surely... <laughs> no. The Amaterasu is huge! What do you mean? I'm assuming Amaterasu is this city, but in the other server. Is that correct, guys? All in favour, say aye. As always, we have no idea where to go. I'm assuming we just have to go back into the city underground again? Okay, okay, okay. So what we're going to have to do is find a way to get to this area in the Amaterasu, through the Amaterasu dimension. And honestly, rather than go through all the dig holes, I think the fastest way of doing that is probably just going straight to the south sector through the swamp. I'm just wondering if we ever want to... Um, I've got some other plans. That we, we, we might do a little detour, guys, here en route to where we're going. I've got a plan. I think in the meantime, we're going to swap out our teammates again. I'm going to put Renamon back in the number one spot here. Right, there is a dive point here we're going to use... And we're going to swim across to the uh, the south sector. And then I'm going to go through the inn, through the bug maze. And get back to Amaterasu that way. Now I think what the game wants you to do here is use one of the circuit boards to get to Amaterasu. But because that's absolutely and utterly toxic, we're not going to do that. At least this way, uh, probably a bit slower than one of the maps. One of the closer dig points. But because I don't know which one. And because the game is going to give us very little in indication of which one to use. I know for a fact this can lead us there in a fairly swift manner. A bit of backtracking required, but honestly at this point nothing we've not done before. There's a fight waiting for us somewhere. A Magnangemon. Is he actually around... Somebody said he's in the cemetery. Is that actually true? He's in the west sector. Oh, he's in the south badlands. I don't remember much about the game last time I played. It was 10 years ago. Yeah. 
It's uh, luckily Kowalski when we're playing this game together so far. We've had like a a group effort every time, so there's normally multiple people with more recent playthroughs in mind. I'm kind of the same as you, where it's not been 10 years since I played it, but it has been like 4 or 5. So a lot of this is completely gone, considering that we beat this game in like a week the last time we played it. I'm uh, glad to be in good hands with the chat here. We've got a good collection of people with guides and playthroughs and some people are playing through it right now as well, so that's been handy. I'm going to actually open my own guide for playing this game at this point because I have no idea what the game wants. But in the meantime, we've got a little fight on our hands here. Luckily, you can actually see this guy from the side of the screen before coming in here, so... Let's give Magna Anjumon a little tussle here and see if he can uh, show us some exciting moves. The last time I fought one of these bosses, we one-tapped them, which um, I'm supposing might be a possibility here as well. We'll check it out. Oh, uh, what is it? Can I help you? I think you can. Hey, Magna Anjumon, I have a favor to ask. Can, you, can I get the Patmon DDNA from your DDNA? I guess what the game is doing here with these fights is they're giving... The game gives you them early, early. Magna Angemon, you're miles away. I can't even see you, bro. This isn't going to be a one-tap, is it? It might be... Oh, no. Oh, actually, not bad. Magna Angemon, are you stronger than the others? Um, that's unlucky. Let's try snow. Kind of weird for Rosemont to be doing snow attacks here, but... You can get that water pistol away from me young lady. Let me know if you can do them. Maybe I should ping the discard when my armies are available. Um, oh, Gate of Destiny. Let's see it. One second, Alpha. Oh! Absolutely and utterly killed. That's illegal. Uh, let's give the XP over to... Hmm. I really do want... Renamon to get some of this XP, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring Black War Graham on. There is an item in the game that actually makes you resistance to KOs, so I'm wondering if that actual move there was an instant KO move. I am going to revive back Renamon so she gets XP from this, because I, I have a strong suspicion, even though this fight's not particularly hard, it probably is worth a couple hundred XP. <laughs> He's so small, dude. Why is he so small? <laughs> Alright. Darkness prevails this time, unfortunately. 160 XP wasn't really that exciting. Alright, cool. Hello! Yeah, I won! Time for the DNA, son. Alright, take it with you. Yeah, I got the Patamon DNA. Thanks, Magna Angemon. Right, so what I think we do now, guys, is I'm going to head back down to the south sector, and then I'm going to head along through the temple in the desert. I'm going to go back to the Amaterasu server building, the main city in Amaterasu, Asuka city, but in Amaterasu, and I'm going to see if I can interact with anything there. If I can't, we'll um, peruse a guide on where to go next, because I feel like that's the only way to keep our sanity at this point. Right, guys, I'm going across the sea. We're going into some really, really rocky territory, because the big daddy Digimon on the other side of this pond are nasty strong. So I need all mines on deck, so to speak. I changed over to Twitch for this. <laughs> Sasha, welcome. Thank you for being here. Thanks for visiting us on YouTube and Twitch today. A man of many cultures. Evoker with the five gifted subs. Hello? Cold Evoker, thank you for the five gifted. Fatal, thank you for the five gifted. Fatal, you've done enough damage this week, young man. I'll have you guys know that Fatal done a huge $50, 50 pound donation two days ago. Dude, what is a golden Kappa train? What the hell is this? I've never seen this before in my entire life. Contribute to earn this exclusive emote for 24 hours, the Golden Kappa. When does the Golden Kappa unlock? Hog Chomp? What are these? I don't know why you're always doing this, especially on a Thursday. We've discussed this before. All right, nice. Listen, you've been tremendous today, guys. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for the level four hype train. Out of nowhere, I might add. Here's little old me just trying to make it through the underwater... The underwater ways of the West Sector. Right. Now that that chaos is out of the way. Let's go ahead and uh, strive onwards. There should be a lot of skinny Digimon in the stadium. I love how the hype train took the perfect amount of time for me to take out the trash. That's probably a good thing, Blue Crew. 
That's probably a good thing. Hey, this guy. We made it at long last. Shakumon, this is the gym. No pain, no gain. All right, amen. Let's see what we have access to. Most importantly, do we have an enhanced speed buff training here or no? Oh, we don't! <gasps> Wait, I've been lied to. This not, not only do we not have the enhanced speed training, but this has also not got the stars. I had a strong suspicion this was going to happen. Hmm. Is the ultimate gym in the North Sector Amaterasu better than the regular gym in the North Sector Amaterasu or no? We may have to do some speed training here regardless of no buffs. Or we just don't. And we sit on it for a long time. Until we get back to North Sector. The game will take us back to the North Sector Amaterasu at some point, right? I think we just sit on it. This feels bad. I kind of want to spend Renamon's points, but like... I thought we were going to get the better training here, but... Ron was the leader, Sparky was the PR person everyone looked to. I was someone making direct English into converse, uh, conversational English. Uh, nice one, Sasha. That's awesome, dude. She needs the XP badly, but... I think we save her for another time. Maybe against some, like, fish Digimon or something. Some some Digimon where we can get the benefit of the ice and the, and the electricity. I think for the time being, we can maybe put Agamon up here. Maybe just use Black War Greymon to fight our way through. Hmm. It was a few years since Sasha. I was there for the last year or two of it, and it was already a process before that. It was cool to have Bandai Namco people reach out and wish Rom a happy birthday because they wanted the English audience to enjoy the game but couldn't get approved. Uh, that is really cool, Sasha. I like that. Yeah, I don't know. Right, we are back in the Mobius Desert. We're trying to look for the Mirage Tower, guys. I don't know if this, uh, if this has the same pattern as before. I also can't remember the last time Frank Team was here. I think we went up first. Did we go up first or left first, guys? I know it's up, left, up, left, up, up. Or is it left, up, left, up, up? I can't rem remember which way we go. Left, up, left, up, up. Let's try left, up, left, up. We'll try this first, and if it works out, great. And if not, then so be it. Up first? I actually can't remember. Let's try left and then up. And if it doesn't work, we'll just reset. Left, up, up, up. See, it's so funny because every time you guys come in here, you tell me different things. That's not the route I remember. I'm going to try this one first and see if it works. It's so funny because I've had like, see, no joke guys, right? Respectfully, over the last like two weeks, I have had about eight people tell me different routes to solve this desert. And so far, about half of them have been wrong. Because the first time we used a different route to get here. I'm going to see if this works. Now that you guys are telling me this, I suspect it won't, but we'll try it for science. Uh, Mon Mon. Hello. I can see the Mirage Tower. It's so close. I did it. The tower is just down the road. Just down the road. So when he says down, does he mean south, as in that way? Dude, I actually don't trust this video game as far as I can throw it. So I'm just going to make a save file and we'll see if Mon Mon's talking mad shit here. Actually, I wonder as well. Can I just avoid that? Uh, so normally it's up and then up again. I'm gonna see if this. Oh, yeah. There you go. So just to be clear, for anybody watching these vods on Digimon 2003, when we came into the desert, we went left that way, and then we went up, and then we went left, and then we went up, and then we went up. That's how we got to Mirage Tower. All these other routes that you guys are talking about. I don't know if they're correct or not, but that's how I got here. So, decide amongst yourselves. I am going to save. And we're going to see what happens here. Is this Kenny? Please tell me this is the right place to be. Wait, says Tamar Heinrich. You're not Kenny. Unless you say the password, I'm not letting you in. What? A password? Uh. Hey, you're Wolfie. Wolfie, it's me, Kenny. Oh, Kenny, thank goodness. Why was he pretending to be called Tamer Heimrich? Hey, Kenny, you're okay? Yeah, I was able to join the Resistance. This is now a base for the Resistance. Right on, Kenny. I know, come on and meet our leader. He might know someone, uh, something to help you. It's this way. Thank the Lord in heaven. Alright, cool. Saved, guys, saved. Hello, this is the ra the hideout of the resistance. We fight from the central location. Okay, this is not what I'd call the central location, but sure. Gatamon, I'm gonna heal here. 
for 80 bucks. Hey, Dumpster, welcome back. Hello. All right. All right, all right, all right. I've heard it from, I've heard about it from Kenny. Let, let's see if we can match up against Leader Chuck. I'm assuming we have to fight this guy. I've heard about it from Kenny. Good luck on defeating the AOA. Wait, what? Uh, yeah, good luck to you too. I do want to help you and fight together, but... Dot, dot, dot. Chuck, why would you? All we can do is hold down the fort. Chuck, that sounds like something a fucking pussy would say. All we can do is hold down the fort. Chuck, what do you mean, you coward? I'm alright, don't worry about me. That's that's a bold-faced lie. Why are we telling these people that we're okay? We need all the help. We need all the help we can get. You got any chips? I'm sorry you came all the way here. No, you're not. You're not sorry. This is the developer speaking directly to you and to your soul, by the way. I'm sorry you came all the way here. They're not sorry. Spoilers. They're not. They've made us do this many times. If we can get Amaterasu City back, I'm sure we can help. But I didn't think they would reprogram Nightmon. Nightmon, any tips for defeating it? Control, alt, delete yourself from existence. Once it starts moving, the way to stop Nightmon is... Dot, dot, dot. You need the four code passes of the city leaders. All the leaders are uh, are caught, so there's no way. City chiefs of the AOA must have taken them. I see. Those AOA. I'll never forgive them for using Digimon for evil. Of course, we haven't given up yet. If there's a chance, we'll uh, make a stand. Just wait until then. Well, anyways, good luck. Chuck, what did you just tell me? Yes, sir. Chuck, are we not battling? Are we done? Got our hands full just defending here, but then we, uh, when we get the chance, we'll fight. So until then, good luck. Chuck, what does that mean? Oh, god damn it. Right, to the guide we go, chat. To the guide we go. Stick with both. Go to Biako City and Amaterasu. This is the city up here, I think. These guys we have to talk to. Sorry. Even if you're under another leader, we can't let you pass. That's our orders. I think we're supposed to speak to these guys. And now we have to go back to the server, right? So the question is, what is the fastest way to get back to regular server from here? We saw... <clears throat> do you know what? Earlier on, this could actually play to our advantage, guys. Because, see, before... Earlier today, we actually came out in a pothole. A dig hole. In the Amaterasu Badlands Desert, did we not? Did we not do that? It was up here. I'll grab another 220 here. Maybe he's not. Maybe he's not close at all. And then I'm going to try and not get lost in the circuit board. This should take me back to North Sector. I think. Unless I'm much mistaken. Our travels and our experience up to this point has led us to this area. How's it going, Draco? How's it going? Welcome. Welcome back. Draco, are you working today? Cool. Level 37, baby. Good. Good. Now, unfortunately for Agamon, that gives him a weird rounding of XP, because I think right now his... Uh, let me just see how much... TP he's got. He's got 30 on the nose, which is actually quite good. That's going to be three good training sessions for him. He still needs another two level ups, though, to get to 40, though. I could try and swap Renamon back in, but we're about to go underground circuit board, and I know she hates it down there, so... Oh, man. It's going to be Digmon galore down here, and I don't think she can actually do anything about it. Unless Digmon... Unless Digmon is weak to water, in which case she might. I'll try Renamon out here and see. I really want her to get one level. So this would be really helpful for her if she can get there. She should level up as well, which is not going to be bad for her. Right. This should take me to the North Sector, guys. Now, we're not supposed to go North Sector right now. We're supposed to go to Asuka, to the uh, to the main room, to speak to Lisa. I think, according to my guide anyway, that's what it's telling me. I think before we go there, we have to go elsewhere. I'm going to try and go and train. I'm going to try and spend my training points at the gym. Now, to get, to get to the north... See, this is where things start getting a bit dicey. Uh, I don't know which way I'm supposed to go in here, which could lead to a lot of problems. This might take me to uh, the Amaterasu version of the North Sector. Which might not be the end of the world, but... Let's just follow this path for the time being. If we get lost in here, guys, I apologise. This is a dead end, that's fine. Unless there's a hole in one of these... 
Right, that's fine. Dead ends are good. Dead ends are a good thing. Still yet to see if Rosemont's going to be able to fight any of these enemies down here. I might actually end up giving Rosemont the machine chip to give her machine resistance because she could really benefit from that. Is, of course, Dramojimon. Let's see if Grand Wave is any good against him. This is a water move that we've not had up until this point. We know that Electric and Ice suck against this guy. Let's see if this is any better. Huge! Absolutely huge. I don't know if that was a crit. That seems like that done a lot of damage. But um, this might actually be great. Genuinely. That's so exciting. Because it's non-stop Dramojimon down here. It's non-stop Dramojimon. I'm going to go around this way and see if the path connects. Because it looks like it might do. Path that way and uh, no paths that way. Okay, so there's nobody else to go at this point other than this direction. Which should stop us from getting lost a little bit slower. This is where things start, might start getting spicy though. This leads to, um, uh, this tunnel is only connected to Matarasu server. If you go north, you'll go north sector. So I do want to go north. Matarasu doesn't really change my plans. I just want to train at the gym. He's telling me to go this way. I'm pretty sure it is, I, I, I'm pretty sure this connects to the regular server as well though. Like when he said that this tunnel is only connected to Matarasu, I think he's talking absolute shit. But I don't know that for a fact, so I'm not going to double down on that. Bearmon. Go north, you get to Masarasu's north sector. I mean, let's do it. This area is going to be absolutely riddled with powerful enemies, but I need to try and get to the gym. Gym is better than a Matarasu, that's what I'm thinking. It's an ambush. That's not good. I think we die here. Ugh. <sighs> Unlucky, I guess. Let's just tag. We'll give Monmon Mon the XP on Canandramon here. Oof. The, or the normal enemies might slap. Yeah, I'm a little bit nervous. I don't also know where it's going to spit me out as well. I don't know what hole it's going to spit me out at. This also doesn't solve my problem as to how to get home to the regular server, but I think I know how to do that from Amaterasu North Sector. I know that if I can get to the in wormhole, I can connect between those two. Probably not the fastest way, but it's the quickest way I can think of from my own knowledge. Yeah, the, uh, the regular enemies, as long as the regular enemies can't beat all of my team, we should be okay. Don't have a lot of heals, but we have enough, I think. Yomon is a tricky bastard, he is. Cody, I don't suppose if, uh, you know how earlier, you know how we just spoke to Giamon and he said that you, this only connects to the Amaterasu server. Do you know if he is lying or not? There was a dude in here the other day giving me advice, Cody. I know you were part of that gang, but I, I'm not sure if you actually know. Yo, yo, we back. Hey, Ursa, welcome. Welcome to the chaos. I've actually only got 23 heals, which is a little bit scary. Less than I thought. If I can get out at North Sector, I can fix this. Not only can we get to the training spot, but we can also get to the inn. We just need to keep as many heals as possible. I'm hoping this will lead us there. We should have an exit point very shortly. Renamon, you look like you could help us. Go north. But if you're not prepared, go back. Mm. I don't know if we are prepared. I don't know if we are prepared. We're about to find out. Emojimon, you are super weak to our attacks now. So as long as he doesn't block... I was tempting the gods there. Alright, cool. Emojimon defeated. Excellent. Mmm, delicious. Suddenly this underground area has went from a, sh a really bad Renamon training spot to a goated training spot for Renamon. I actually think as well that's why the enemies are not as incessantly spawning here. This should be the exit, correct? Okay. I'm going to take one more fight here and see if I can get Renamon to 40 against these Dromojimon. Alright. Been good, also been doing the grind trying to unlock the submarine. Oh, Ursa. I hope it's I hope you're doing well. I hope the morale's up with you. Oh, the submarine part, man. The submarine. Submarimon. He lives in my dreams, he haunts me. He haunts me, dude. Renamon is getting to the point where she is a wet noodle a wet noodle. Boot Mountain! We made it. I think what we're going to try and do here is one, survive. Two, we're going to try and go Amaterasu 
snow mountain to regular snow mountain and then just take it from there. Does that sound good? There's it's it kind of stinks, but I think that might be the best play. I know the one you're talking about. I have to try and get through this mountain before I die, by the way. I'm going to try and get to the gym as quickly as possible. I was mad. When I was a kid, guys, I was mad into, like, um, myths and, like, legends. There's a lot of YouTube channels out there that cover, like, myths and legends, and I absolutely love those. If, if done right, you know. Uh, I remember I went out for the day once with my family, and it was like, you know, I was really young. We were, like, driving around Scotland somewhere in the middle of nowhere, and, you know, it's me, my sister, my brother in the back of the car, and my mum and dad fighting in the front. And uh, we stopped at this, like, garden... It's like a garden centre thing. Massive kind of open warehouse. Somewhere where you'd go to, like... It's a, it's more of, like, a road stop on the highway than, like, anything else. But you can buy, like, plants and plant pots and seeds and a bunch of garden furniture garbage, right? Somewhere that, as, a, as an adult, I'd probably maybe quite enjoy going to, honestly. But, like, as a kid, I was like, man, this sucks. Anyways, while we were in the cafe, my mum and dad are getting a coffee... And uh, I went into the little kind of book store area, which was this tiny little corner. And there was this giant book. It was like myths. A thousand myths and legends. I was like, Mum, can I have this, please? She was like, no, I'm not buying you that. Get the fuck. I was like, Mum, please. She was like, do you promise you and your brother will stop fighting for the rest of the day if I buy you this? I was like, maybe. So then Lucky Jack walked out with this $5 book. And it was so cool, man. It had like everything in it. I, I tried to find it once. I couldn't find it. It had like... Everything from, like, the Loch Ness Monster to the big Bigfoot to, you know, ghosts and... Oh, it was great. I loved it. I kind of wish I could read you guys stories from it, but I'll need to find it one day. Renamon, Mon, Mon, Agamon, it's time. We need to train you. We've come all this way. Magnamon, this is the legendary gym. Hyperversion. It's the hardest in Digimon Online, but do you want to do it? Mate, I've got no other choice. My Digimon stink right now. Right, Renamon. You absolutely need lots of things. You're falling behind on speed, but you need spirit and you need... Well, you need to land your attacks. Let's go spirit first, guys. No boost on speed still. This game hates me. Why is there not an enhanced speed? It's because the game knows that the speed stat is broken. Right, okay, it's fine. I'm going to stop being feral for a second. Super yoga, super trained Digimon spirit. We need this badly, guys. We need the big damage. We need all of the damage. Please, Renamon. I've always believed in you. This is your moment. I really need you to pull this one out of the bag. Please. Come on, Renamon. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good. Okay, again. Good. Come on, Renamon. Bring it home. Renamon, you juicy son of a gun. Right. Guys, we're all in. Send it, Renamon. Renamon. Okay, I'll take a spirit buff of 39. Not bad. Let's do wisdom first. I'm gonna do five. I'm gonna do five and five. Please, Renamon, please. I need some points here, I'm begging you. Good, good start, good start, good start. Please, go, go, go that way. Go. No, Renamon, bad, naughty, very naughty. I need you to just pull something out of your butthole here. Alright, good. One more for the boys. Please, Renamon. One more for the boys. Good. Okay, certainly not bad. It's not amazing, but you know what? I'll take it. 30 is better than nothing. Renamon, I've got speed for you. Five points. Fix it, mate. Renamon, I swear to Christ. Renamon! This is a bastard! Okay. Renamon, you're dead to me. Mon, Mon. You're starting on the speed training. Again, it's not enhanced. Not much I can do about it, guys. It looks like there's no enhanced speed training in the game. Mon, Mon. Send it, bro. Show them how it's done. Mon, Mon! I didn't come all this way for you to be a fuck-up idiot! Right. Send it again. Good. I think your spirit stat is uh, almost as good, almost great as Emperor. You just need harder hitting moves. I think you may be right. Mon Mon with 31 in speed. He's got 10 TP left. We're sending it again, guys. We're going again. This is what we came for. This is what we trained for. Mon Mon. Send it. Good. Come on, you little punk. Treat your Digimon with love and care, they said. 
it'll be fine, they said. All right, not bad, honestly. He's getting there, boys. He's getting there. Uh, Mon Mon will come back to you in a minute because I don't know what to do with his remaining 10 TP. Agamon, nice and easy speed send at home for the boys. Agamon, you mega need speed big time. So get it together. Good. Here we go. I wish I could give some of these points over to Renamon, honestly. Agamon, you little dancer. Come on, mate. Come on, mate. Good. Come on, Agamon! It's always at the last the last moment that the pressure gets too much for them. Alright, good. Agamon, honestly, we're sending you again. That was pretty good. Repeat. Repeat, Agamon, repeat. Yes. Agamon. Don't you dare. Okay. I need that badly. Again. Okay, not bad. Two out of three is fine. I'll take two out of three. Right. Uh, you've got ten more points, Agamon. You've, your strength is maxed out. I don't think Agamon cares anymore about his intellect or his spirit. I think we're we're going. Full send. Won't you think about it? I was gonna say it was gonna be porridge for fucking an absolute month there, Agamon, had you not pulled that one out of the bag, you little shit. Right. Okay, uh yeah, like I said, Renamon, I'm a little bit nervous. Just to make him tankier, perhaps. I don't hate that idea. We get maximum value on it. Let's do it once, guys. I know this is probably ridiculous, but it's a really good value to NTP training. He's got a lot of HP, Mon Mon. He dodges a lot, so if we can pull something miraculous off here, this could be really good. Go on, you little blighter. Mon Mon, I call upon you in this moment in time. Land this one, Mon Mon, and fully send it into the Hall of Heroes, the God of Digimon, the man, the myth, the legend. You've been the ace of this playthrough, Mon Mon. This is your time to really put on that captain's mantle and bring home the bacon. Do it. Yes! <laughs> Woo! Okay. Worth. Alright, Mon Mon, you've ascended. We're slightly better. Not by much, but slightly. There is lots and lots and lots of dig holes around here, guys, where Digmon will take me to another part of the game. My goal right now, based on where we have to go for the story, is to get to Asuka. Asuka server and also Asuka city. Sorry, that gets a bit complicated sometimes, but in order to get there, I have a route in mind. There's probably a better route that I just don't know about, and if so, if you're watching this as Digimon Lords, I apologize. Is it this way or is it up the way? I'll save at the end anyway. I think this is actually the wrong side, but... We're gonna go through a wormhole here to try and get to regular North Sector Mountains, and then we have to go back to Asuka. If we can get some XP in the process, that would be ideal. We just need to try and support the other two. It, to be fair, you know Agamon, who is Black War Greymon, soon to be regular War Greymon, he is also very good too, just not on the same level as Monmon. Renamon unfortunately is lagging behind, but she has she has her own strengths. Like for example, check this out. So you know, remember these guys, Dromojimon, these used to absolutely wreck us, but she now, a thing of the past. I was going to say he's going to block this and make me look like a fool, I just knew he was going to do that, now he's going to one-shot me. Please don't. <laughs> Anyways, remember how I said these Dromojimon were a thing of the past? Well, they're still technically a thing of the past, just sometimes you have to blast to beat them. Yeah, thing of the past, totally blue crew, don't you? Hey, check this guy out though, blue crew, am I right? Can you imagine this guy trying to get in your front door? Mr. Swole over here. I don't know what that's supposed to be on his... Is that wings on his back, guys? I don't know if that's like shoulder blade armor pads or wings or both. Either way, he's a baller. Nice. Congratulations, Renamon. Fantastic. We got a full heal from that. I'll take it. We need health. We need health. Right. In order to navigate this area, guys, there's going to be a decision we have to make soon. There is an exit in this underground circuit board that will take us back to the North Sector regular Asuka server. I have no idea where that is, though. We've been in here recently, and I can't remember exactly where to go. A part of me thinks it's down one of these paths to the right when the option becomes available. I don't think... I think that's a dead end up, up there. So I'm just going to go this way. This should be right. Dark Knight 93 how's it going, homie? Hello. That is Mallow, my Otismon. Right, I think we go down and around... Go east for Asuka and west for Amaterasu. So when he says east, he means this way. This should take us to where we want to go. It's still going to be a bit of a trek, but again, we could use the, the XP anyway, so... 
eventually I will be able to show you guys me fighting a, a Digmon and or Remojimon and winning. Does that just connect up to the other? Ah, uh, see now I'm not sure. That has to be the right way. It could also be down here and to the right. Hey, Dramojimon, what's up? Please don't block these. Thank you, that's a one shot. Every day. Uh, just kidding. Wait a minute. Dramojimon, don't, please. It's fine, we can tank these now. Right, uh, Grand Wave is fine. We're good, we're good. Everybody blink. I'm fine, what about you? Amazing. Dark Knight, I've never been better. I've never been, I've been better for sure. It's kind of like a water jetpack, yeah? Uh, something like that, yeah. Not scientifically possible, Dromojimon is the goat. I do like Dromojimon a lot, Blue Karoo. Apart from when he shafts my butt. We've been saying that a lot recently. We maybe need to kill, kill it on the butt humour. Right. Do I want to go north or down? I think... I actually can't remember which way it is. I'm going to go this way first, and if it leads to the wrong way, I'll just go... I'll come back along here and go down. He said stay east. This has to be it, right? Oh, boys. Could it be? Could it be? Could it be? Did we actually navigate successfully? <gasps> okay, thank god. Uh, I'm gonna go down and round and through the drill tunnel. Through the little dig tunnel over here. Now guys, we should be raring to smurf. Asuka, I'm coming baby. By the way, just as a hit, uh, an FYI, I'm pretty sure the game's about to take a fat shit on our happiness because see when we get to Asuka in this area, I'm pretty sure the game's going to send us straight back to the Amaterasu server, which is such an ugly, ugly thing to do, but hey-ho. Digimon World 3. Digimon World 2 is the GOAT, to be honest. I do enjoy Digimon World 2. Mr. Coomer, you have an interesting name. <laughs> uh, we want to go this way, I think. I hope this is correct. See, the thing is, Renamon's so good in these underground areas that I feel like this is definitely the, the time to leave her in slot especially if she can pick up some levels here i'm doing good nice one dan ah yes a champion or is it an ultimate in this game versus a mega almost gets beat it's uh i'm pretty sure mojimon is considered a champion he's just really strong he's just a snow digimon that's why he's in the mountains guys he's just a snow digimon there's only i mean you got frigimon and oh god kurosaramon i don't know if this is gonna be good against you darkness type please tell me that hurts Okay, actually not bad. Hey! You're going nowhere, son! Sit down. Think you can run away from me? Do you even know who I am? I'm the Rose. I'm the Rose Mommy. 150 XP. I'll take these. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, you. I'm not even going to speak to you. I know what you're going to say. I think we want to go this way, guys. Oh, wait. Didn't we go here? Did we go the wrong way through here before? Didn't we go this way and it took me back to the Badlands area earlier? I think it did. I think we need to go this way. Oh god, chat. I'm getting lost. I think this takes me down to Plug Cape. Please tell me if I'm wrong. Oh god, chat. I think I'm wrong. Where am I going, chat? Oh god. Ugh. Um, Is it that way, chat? No, chat. Mmm... I'm not so sure about this. Oh no, chat, it stinks. This might be it, this might be it, this might be it. This could be a dead end. Chat, I think we're lost. Ooh. Oi. DW2 is the best in that era. Do you think so, Oz? Do you think so? <gasps> could this be? The Kicking Forest. Are we in the Asuka? This'll do. Chat, this will do. This this will do. Gonna interest you in some DW4, good sir. Question mark, guys. Don't you dare. I got a down jacket. Oh, that would be good for some of you guys. Uh, I can't jump off this cliff. This is not as good as I thought, chat. I thought I could jump down there. Let's go ahead and put on the uh, the down jacket. Let's have a look at this. What are we dealing with here? Renamon, can you put this on? The beam armor. The down jacket. Oh, God. Ja jacket for arctic weather this stinks guys i thought we were in the right area we're not in the right area this is bad i'm not in the right area this is not good 
I don't think we can get too much. I don't think we get, we just need to end up in plug cape, guys. That shouldn't be too hard, right? Oh, I'm not lost. You guys are lost. I know exactly where I'm going, guys, which is why I'm not going to end up end up in the Badlands. All in favour, type 1 in the chat. Where does that go? Do you think that, think that goes the right way? Do you think that takes me to plug cape chat? Probably not, right? Thank you for the Twitch primes, guys. What was I saying? Oh, yes. All of these things are your... F guys, it's all subjective. If DW1 is your favourite... If that's your favourite Digimon game, as is the universal correct answer, then that's good. And if you don't think that, if you think DW World 4 is your favourite, then that's fine. You can be wrong, but that's okay. It's all Gucci, fam. Nah, DW3 is the best objectively kappa. Guys, somebody put some golden kappas in there. Where's my where's my gold kappas at? Guys, I don't I don't know if I'm going the right way. I think I am. If this is the wrong way, I'm really sorry. I think this is the I think this is correct. If we end up in the right place. Oh, Renamon! Yes. Yes, that's that's good. Right, how do we make sure we're going the right way? This way? Down the way, right? I think this is going to work out just fine. This has to be... I think this has to be... Plug Cape. We're going to pop out and Plug Cape, guys, and it's going to be just fine. <gasps> this actually looks good. Is If there's a little Digimon in the top left here that's not Patamon, GG. If it's Patamon, we cry. <gasps> we actually did it! Plug Cape! The goat! I'd like to dedicate that journey to Orion, Kalka, and all the other supporters today. Tapermon, take this. Don't pretend like you didn't enjoy that. The animation for Rosemon's attacks in this game are bizarre because she doesn't even she doesn't even bring down the whip. She kind of jumps in with a whip in the air and then kicks them. It's like a uh, she's like feigning with the left hook and then bopping them with the right. You know, she jumps in and with a whip coming down as the overhead and and all the Digimon are like this blocking for it and then she kicks them right in the nuts. Disgusting tactics, honestly. Right, we've made it all the way back to Asuka. Should we try and win a Digimon card battle here, guys? Should we take a little break from the nonsense to try and win some card battles? I think we could. I think our deck is powerful enough now. These people don't know what we've been through. They don't know that we are now the defeater of Divermon, aka the most elite duelist in all of the kingdoms. So I think when we heal, save, and then battle these kids, we'll smash them. What do you think? After this, we'll go talk to Lisa the douchebag, and then we'll go to Matarasu. Okay. A fake out? Lucaro, you're a fake out. Right. Guys, I'm here. This guy's whooped our ass so many times at cards, I'm thinking this might be the time we beat him. I'm gonna take him down. Guys, this is it. This is where we hold him, this is where we fight. Rumble Arena 2 is Brawl. Still great, but something intangible is missing. You know what's not do you know what's not gonna be missing for our day today, chat, when we go to sleep tonight? A Winnick Digimon car battles. Let's go. Let's venture the circuit board more, says Dan. Man, I thought you liked me. Why would you say that? I'm gonna draw two cards. One of them's gonna be Kurosaramon. Watch this. Part in the cards, chat. <laughs> Never mind. For the VOD viewers, he took 15 hours to get back from the North Sector. Dumpster, how dare you. That's the fastest we've traversed the North Sector. Okay, I'm getting better. Don't take that away from me, okay? Oh, we can't summon Growmon. We can get Garudamon in here, though. And we're gonna let this enemy meet the bear. Guys, it's winnable. Watch as I smurf on this fool. He thinks he's got what it takes, right? He thinks he's got what it takes, and then out of nowhere, watch this. Watch this, chat. We crush his dreams. We absolutely pound them into the dirt. Get removed, vile human. So I ordered Chinese food, and they gave me five fortune cookies. Now I'm assuming I ate them all. Which fortune cookie is the correct one? Um, The last one, Blue Crew. Get out of here, Talmon. You're trash. Wait, Talmon's part of my main squad. I take that back. Guys, did I not say where we're going to come in here and dumpster these, these little lads? Get in the bin. You can't get through my Monzimon. He's a brick He's a brick tank. Who does temporary Digimon is eternal. Thursday's the perfect day for treating yourself for sure. What are you guys talking about? Talk to me, says Emperor Dramon, when you beat Etamon in Amaterasu Card Island. Well, I'm getting there, guys. We gotta walk before we can sprint, and we have to sprint before before we can triple backflip, okay? That made no sense, but don't worry about it. Right, round two. 
I've got no special cards. This is going to be a bit dicier. I'm not promising you guys we win this round because it's looking a bit grim. We're just going to have to hit him with the Raw Dog Shellmon Supremes. There's the Kurosaramon that we needed in round one. Uh, we win these. Guys, we win these. Legitimately. I want to be the very best that no one ever was. Get in the trash, you little shitter. These DW3 underground sections of the stream make me feel like a kid in the car watching my parents argue over driving directions. There's no arguments here, Valkyrie. I'm right all the time. I'm at the wheel. Sometimes you guys rip the handbrake out of nowhere and I have to deal with that, but that's okay. Tamer Naki. I don't have the knack for this. Unlucky, bro. What about this guy? Can we whip two in a row? Card battle is the best, says Tamer Wong. Tamer Wong? Get ready to sniff my bong. <laughs> All right. What if I eat all the What if I eat all at the same time? Looking at the fortune cookies and breaking the cookies up to fit them in my mouth. Some some same time now. I have no way of knowing the fortune of all the cookies was eaten simultaneously. Blue crew. I think the only reasonable thing to do at this point is just order another Chinese takeout and then just read the first cookie that you get. Obviously. Here we go. One A pack kick W dumpster. Don't you dare laugh at my misfortunes like that. Stop it, chat. I'm going in. We're going to give this guy the Waymon, also known as my dad. Here we go. The problem here is the packs are trash. Guys, I don't want you to tell me after I get the pack that it's trash like you guys knew all along. Where was this advice 10 minutes ago before we fought them, eh? Guys, I have a pair of eyes too. I can look at the at, the, at what's happening and then comment in hindsight. Nobody said the packs are trash before I fought. Jack Reed, where were you 10 minutes ago when I needed you? Wait, what else has this guy got? What else has he got? Oh, I can return one Digimon to the hand. Let's just pass, chat. We're going to let him super buff. We're going to let him super buff. Look, 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 look. Summons Devimon. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. And then we pass. And then he summons another Devimon. Right? And then... <laughs> we hit him with the Eclipse on Dude. <laughs> what? What do you mean? No! My my plans were foiled. Wait a minute. You cheating son of a stinking... No, you wouldn't. Wait, we draw. We draw these. No, we don't. We lose these. Fuck. <coughs> Chat, wait. No. My plans were foiled at the last moment. What is this bullshittery? I've never seen that card before. It's okay. We win in round two. We win in round two. Everybody, don't worry about it. I need that card. This is it. This is it, this is it, this is it, this is it. We smurf on them, we smurf, we smurf. Guys, relax, shut up. Listen, I've got this. Choose a card from the deck and add it to the hand. We're going for the... Oh, oh we got the triple. Guys, we got Exodia. We can summon another Kurosaramon for four. And then we never lose, right? Watch the raw beef, chat. I'm about to I'm about to lay down the raw beef. Check, 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 check. Here we go, here we go. Big beef. Big beef coming in. Look, 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 look. Watch this. The four Kurosaramons. The only thing better than three Kurosaramons. Watch. Watch. We play the... Oh, wait, I don't... Can I play all? I can play the whole hand. He will never be able to defeat this. He just doesn't have what it takes. Right. Now let him come. Six cards. Wait, where's his... Where's his cards, chat? No. No! No! <laughs> what do you mean? No, you wouldn't. Greymon, carry me. The fuck is that thing? What kind of big penis play is that? Who is this guy? Who's this duelist? No! This guy's going to give me a really good pack. Of, this guy's going to give me a really good card booster pack, guys. This was a hard-fought battle. Surely a game as good and as balanced as DW3 is going to give me a sick pack to, to award me for this tough, tough win. Yeah? Big packs, yeah? We're going to open these sick packs of sick cards, guys. Look, it was just a gimmick. These are actually really good rare packs. I'm never coming back here. 
Onwards. The good news is we defeated two of these these stinkers. We need to go in here and talk to Lisa so that she can tell us to go around the map once again and then we can uh, cry. Everybody pay attention because when Lisa gives us instructions, she's only going to give us them once and they're probably going to be useless. So uh, let's just see what we got here. We're looking to we're looking for the main the main room. I think it's this way. If it's not this way, then I apologize. I think it's in here, though. The master room. Lisa. Hey, Wolfie, did you find someone? Yes, we found Kenny. Yes, I met up with some of the people of the Resistance. It was a complete waste of time. They're useless. Good job. You're great, Wolfie. I know. But to get to the Amaterasu City, we need the four code passes to stop Nightmon. Code pass? What's that? Eth, you are doing my nutting. Oh, I know about that. It's the ID pass with colors. Uh-huh. ID pass with colors, then these red ID and blue ID? We have two. I think we need four. Yeah, that's it. Why do you have that? The AOE chief I defeated had them. Then if we can get the other two, we can beat Nightmon. Then the other city chief must have it as well. Yes, this should help. Oh, but wait. We gotta do something about Baihu City, so that's where one of the other gym leaders are. The security there is really tight. Hmm, what to do, says Lisa. Let's see if they can actually come up with an idea of what, what's actually the best plan. I know, we can get the resistance to help us. They're in Mirage Tower, right? They are. Don't make me go back there. Y yes Please don't. Okay, I'll go ask them. Whew. Okay, does that mean I don't have to? Keith, let's go. Nick, you stay here. All right, yeah, leave it to us. So, where am I supposed to go? I'm not supposed to go to Mirage Tower, surely. Then I'll go back to Baihu. All right, Amaterasu. Good luck, Wolfie. All right, there we go. A clear indication of where to go. Thank you. That's all I ever wanted. Just to see you smiling. Right, Amaterasu north side, guys. Now we just need to get there. <laughs> I'm just thinking about how the best way to do that is... Asking chat what the best hole is as well. Listen, I know you guys have never seen a hole in your life, chat, but for all intensive purposes, it's your your only hope. Does anybody know how to get to Amaterasu North Sector in a com a nice easy manner from where we're at currently? Anybody got any ideas? Hello there, sir. Now's your final chance. Finally, I mean it. Let me guess, a unique item for Patamon by any chance? Hmm. The Ronin helmet admired by all members. This Kotamon exclusive helmet. Oh yeah, great. So far, every item we've picked up in this auction has been... No, it's a lie. The last item we had was from Onmon, actually. A Kotamon exclusive item. Perfect. Really good, thanks. I may as well add it to my list of... My museum of useless artifacts. We actually have Kotamon as a, as a Digimon, so this isn't totally... We'll do it. Because somebody's going to get mad if we don't. Seems like no one else. The Ronin helmet sold to that daft bastard in the corner who can't use it. Thanks, that's me. Amazing. Yay. Let me go white mask with that. Next order is dope. Super fun to play. Buddy, I'm glad you think so. Right, look over here. Check this out, guys. Hello. Hey, that's the Patmon DDNA. Thanks. Okay, I'll add Patmon as your partner as promised. Give me that little jingle noise that we all know and love. Guys, we just picked up Patamon. Now we can all live our lives happily. Is it this one? Or is it actually a hole at the beach? Will we give this one a go? This looks like it kind of might work. Let me pee, chat. I'm coming back after a pee. Don't do anything silly while I'm, while I'm not here. I'm going to need all hands on deck, all minds in check. Right time, kill them all. Okay, okay. Guys, an Emperor Dramon we trust. Here goes nothing. Shit. Pyodramon next. We've already got Pyodramon. We did that days ago, Aussie. So you don't need to worry about that, homeboy. Kill them all. Time to riot. Guys, we're not rioting. Stop it. Have you ever considered the fact that we are basically walking petri dishes with the amount of bacteria all over our bodies? Jackwire, that is only the type of bizarre comment I would expect to see from someone as um, weirdly wired as yourself. 
Have you all ever considered Twitch Primes in the chat? Valkyrie, that's more of my language. Somebody promote Valkyrie. Alright, uh, let's go. Do, 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 do. Maybe it's more like Actimel though, Cactuar. You know, like good bacteria. Agamon, please give me some advice. This road north is to get near Asuka City. Please give me more than that. Agamon, please! Where's the other roads going, Agamon? I don't need to know about Asuka. Why do they always tell me about where to go after I come that way? I'm going this way, Agamon, and if it turns out to be a dead end, I'm coming back to kill you. Kill you to death. Chat, this should be the way. Do you know the way? I think this is the way. This is definitely, potentially, maybe the way. Guys, if it's not, I'm sorry in advance. Oh, good luck. Giamon, please. This tunnel goes to Asuka and Amatsurasu. If you go north, you'll get to Amatsura Jungle Grave. What happens if I go west? The jung Amatsurasu Jungle Grave. That's not exactly where we want to go. Down? Back the way? I'm going back the way. Did someone say Riot Jack? You stand down. Jack, you're not qualified for this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Little level up here on the boys. Where is Agamon? He's around here somewhere. Chat, I think I've took, I've, if I take one wrong move, we're up the creek. I should have also bought heals before leaving. What's the chances we'll be able to buy some heals at the next city? There is a boss fight coming up as well, and I don't know if we're ready for that, but... Agamon, are you here? Where was Ag Agamon's here? Right, okay, Agamon's here. So, down from Agamon. And when you say down, you guys mean, like, along and then this way? This seems like down, yeah? Balmung? Isn't that a dot hack character? I mean, maybe, Blue Crew. Why don't you ask them? Why don't you say, hello, Mr. Balmung? Is this a, is this a dead end, Jink? Do you say? Ali, how's life? We go these ways. We go these ways? This seems good. Emperor Dramon, I fully trust in you. I'm believing. I'm... All of my faith. All of my eggs are in your basket right now. God, my nose is so itchy. Ah. Renamon, you don't need any more heals. You'll be fine. Boop -a -boop -a -boop -a -boop. Uh, this way, maybe? Maybe? Maybe this way? Guys, there's a lot of options here, and I'm feeling like this might be the wrong way. Wait. To the right! To the right, to the right. Everything you own in a box to the right. Where's this going to take us? I just want to have a little peek. The Kicking Forest in the East Sector. The Amaterasu Kicking Forest East. Up and right. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. There's no way that the right one takes us out in the other, the other bit, does it? That would be absurd logically. But then nothing about this game has a logical balance, so... Who knows? It should be okay. Right, guys? Oh, God. This tunnel goes to both Asuka and Amaterasu. North is Amaterasu Central Park. South is the server. Honestly, you know what? It's not bad. This'll do. For what for what we need, this'll do. Not exactly what we had in mind, but you know what? It, it, it works. It works. I'm going to have a peek and see where this is. Honestly, this could be fine. Central Park, South Sector. This could work. This could actually... This, unironically, is fine. Follow Lou. You guys are saying go down the way. There's Badlands. Okay. Okay, chat. I'm trusting. We had a good deal there. That was a pretty good deal. If I open the other box and it's one dollar. Wolfie, do you want the plat ID? Dumpster, I don't know what you're asking me. So you guys are saying go down the way, yeah? This is Badlands territory, is it? It is. I'm just trash at map reading. I'm, I'm trusting, chat. I'm trusting. I'm trusting. Lewis. Emperor Jamon. This is it. Okay. This way. Raremon drops electric power too. You can get it where Datamon was in Asuka Sewers and Matarasso next time you go back. What are you talking about, Dumpster? I don't know what the plot idea is. Is that for training? Is that what that is? Badlands? Oh, lads. 
Boys, lads, boys, lads. This works. I know where we are. We're next to where Magnangemon was. Okay, good. We made it. Good stuff, everybody. Hats on the back all round. Well done. Makes no sense that that down the way leads to this, but I guess it goes like full circle. I'd, I'd, oh, I don't know. Always trust us at Mr. Wolfie. Fatal, you... Chat, if I trusted you every single time someone wrote something bizarre in my chat, okay, I'd be dead by now. It's a good point, though. I didn't know that Datamon would give me that for super speed training. That's good to know, guys. As soon as we clear out Douchebag McClumfer, we'll be able to get to that. Okay, nice. Renamon, you're back to full HP. Cool. Right, so we need to go north, guys. This direction, back to the north area, the desert. We're going north of the desert to the city. Hopefully, when I get to the city, I should be able to get in. If I can, great. I will save my game ASAP. And if not, then we cry. Okay. We should be able to get in now, which we can because our friends have arrived from Mirage, which means good. Also, why, just as a side note, why did they, why did they make you? I know we've, we've had a long list of complaints about this game, but why on earth? When you're in Mirage Tower in this part of the map, why do they make you go all the way back to a Matarasu, like from a Matarasu to a Suka regular? Talk to Lisa just to come all the way back here. It is absolutely mind boggling. Like they could have just not put that in and it would have made the game definitively better. Like, <sighs> we haven't actually been into the city yet. I'm going to just check with Gargamon to see if he's got any better weapons for Renamon here. We've got the laser cannon, downgrades, downgrade, royal spear. Crystal rod is another upgrade for um, uh, Renamon here. I'm going to buy one of these for 22,000 bits. Give her a slight buff. Honestly, at this point, I'd rather that we just up the Renamon's accuracy, but we can't do that yet. Uh, the Atlas Buster is a downgrade for Agamon. Don't need to worry about that. Trihorn, he's already got. The Garuru Cannon is also a downgrade for Monmon. Beret, Misty Armor. No, that's fine. I'm going to buy some heals here. I'll be able to access uh, Piximon in here. Let me just go ahead and top up. Buy Power Charge. Let's go and get a bunch of these. You never really have too many, so that'll do. Buy eight of these. I'm going to buy some more life discs. I'm going to change your Digivolution type. We're going to get rid of Stingmon and we're going to bring in Big Daddy Sakuyamon, also known as my queen. Do, 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 do. Hello, Mr. Lightsaber Man. Are you by, by who, Chief? That's right. What do you want? I don't know, a therapist? Give me the white ID pass that you have. I see. He 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 he. No matter what you do, victory will be ours. Now is it's time. Now it's time to learn your lesson. Oof. Here we go. Guys, it's a showdown. I'm concentrating, don't bother me. Uh do we want to just fully send Ooh. Rockmon probably weak to I mean we could do it. We could do it. Air Destroyer is oh it's dark. I thought fire, um, strength and fire, weak and ice. Terror Destroyer is a dark matter attack, not fire attack. Which makes my fire field not so exciting. Let's just go Terror Destroyer, see how much damage it does. Unless he blocks it, of course, which he might do. Pray for me, boys. We're going in. Oof. Oof. We hold. Uppercut from Rockman from downtown. Felt that one. Let's go. Jacob, thanks for being here today, by the way. Appreciate you, man. Alright. Nice. Old. Old. How much is that? Oh, not so bad. Maybe uh, Black War Greymon's just going to carry right through and we get all the XP on Agamon. That would certainly be fine. Although I would assume the last Digimon here is going to be the strongest. Griffinmon taking a lot of damage by the looks of things. His posture is giving it away. Alright, I do want to keep Agamon alive here. So if I could finish this guy off and survive, that would be great. I think what we do is we heal now, hit him, and then survive the next hit, swap Digimon. We bring out someone else. 
Maybe Sakuyamon in our debut? I don't know. Let me see how powerful the last guy is, because like I said, I'm kind of nervous that we lose to the last enemy. I'm going to go for a physical attack to finish this guy off. I would assume that was kind of a risky move, because Gryffindor is probably quite a fast Digimon, and because speed determines your block chance or your dodge chance on physical attacks, that was maybe a bit scary, but... Um, Ebidramon... Likely to be weak to Talmon, but I also have this... I've got a strong suspicion that Talmon might just get one-tapped. We could give it a go anyway, though. Sukuyamon? Is it time? I said Talmon, but you know, I'm Renamon. Renamon into her Digivolution. Maybe we can even blast it here if this, uh, if we can survive these. Probably gonna have to take a few hits here. Oh, she's just dead. Of course she is. My useless sack of shit. Alright, let's go Armormon, I guess? I have, um, wait, is this, where was my cannon run? What, what am I, am I trolling? I'm trolling. Maybe this is a good opportunity, actually. I'm gonna bring back, am I gonna do this? Seems like a fail. I should have brought out Cannon Drummond. I don't know why I'd... I'd be... I've done this so many times in the game that I'm just on autopilot. Nice block. We needed that. All right, we're just disrespecting this guy. I'm gonna Digivolve up to Cannon Drummond. I should have led with this, my bad. Oof. I don't know how to make a fruity cocktail. Jack, I saw you sending me pictures of your fruity cocktails you made last night. Don't lie to me. And on a Wednesday as well, you naughty boy. Right, old. We're going to blast this guy. Dramon. He's got Dramon in his name. If this doesn't do damage, guys, I don't know what will. The game lies to me. Maybe he's considered a marine Digimon and we need Fishbuster. Hmm. Dumpster says, I don't blame Renamon. I blame the trainer keeping her on 250 defense in the late game. Dumpster, after... All of the discussions we've had. I can't tell if you're trolling me. All of the discussions about spirit, intelligence, speed, how special attackers are slower to, you know, level up because you need to train three instead of two. Was I supposed to stop and give her defense? And amongst her being behind in damage, speed, and accuracy, like, I can't tell if you're trolling me, I genuinely can't. <laughs> like, I don't know what you guys want from me. Do you know what I think I'd have her at 500 defense if I could? When was I supposed to have trained her in defense? I can't, I actually can't tell. Like, this has to be a, this has to be a prank. Mrs. Wolfie, oh, pizza. Mrs. Wolfie, you're a star. Let me do a swap around. Thank you. Thanks, Mrs. Wolfie, love you, Mrs. Wolfie. Hey, you see that? Don't mess with me, says Wolfie. Huh? Is this? Did you kill him? He's just gone. Yep. We neutralized him into the abyss, guys. Yes, I got the white ID pass. One left to go. Let's honey. I'm assuming the last one is actually in the north sector. Is that right? Is that where we're going next? Jack, I have no idea where you're going. I'm just here to watch you get lost and go crazy. Jack, that happened a long time ago, brother. A long time ago. It's okay, chat. It does. Do you know what? It happens, guys. You know the bit in Harry Potter where he's carrying the, the Horcrux, right? And it turns him into a miserable bastard. That's like me playing this game. Somebody's got to carry the fucking Horcrux, and it's me. You guys are Ron and Hermione wondering why I'm getting my panties in a twist all, all of a sudden, right? You guys would understand if you carried the fucking Horcrux for a couple of minutes, yeah? That's me right now. The one way drop down at the entrance. This way. I see it. We're going in, boys. Well done, everybody. Okay, okay, okay. Good. We're going to the mountain. This is actually the one we did go... This is the one we used earlier, actually. So, I should have known this. I just forgot. Sorry. We did actually use this exact path earlier, which is uh, kind of papega, but it all becomes a blur after a moment, you know, after a, after a hot minute. When, you, when you're in the cell with the padded walls, chat, every day becomes a blur. Um, we probably want to go, like, north or some shit, right? Is this is this what we did earlier? I feel like this is where we went earlier. Ron's not even that bad. If I was Ginger, I'd be proud. No. I'm going back. Lewis is a stud. I would. I would marry Lewis. The, the whole jokes, those started last week, they've not been funny since, okay? 
Stop it. Right, Lewis. Where are we going? Up the chimney. Okay, delicious. Excellent work, everybody. Good. We're getting there. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -bum, bum, bum, bum. Oh, hey, Guillaumon. This tunnel is only connected to Matarasa. If you go north, you've got the north sector. Yay! Let's do it. Guillaumon can't send us in the wrong way, right, guys? Right, right. Okay, we're going north, baby! North! This way? Left. Go north to get to Master S, who's in our server! Yeah, dude, we're doing it! Chat, we're doing it! I wish Armored Digimon were more utilised in games. Flamesmon, Magnemon, even Gold Rapidmon. I mean, we'd need to see a new fucking Digimon game to see some of these old Digimon come back. That would be a... That'd be a nice start going for Broke. Momo, if I read this comment and it is in any way, shape, or form about raw dog and something. And now I have regret, Momo. And now I have regret. I missed the whole joke, says Jack. Jack, stop it. Jack, stand down. Guys, we made it to Boot Mountain. Big salute to our friends in the chat. Specifically to RPG Lewis and also Emperor Jamon. We made it. Well done, everybody. Agamon still needs to get to level 40, so I'm going to keep him in slot 1. Any XP we get here, GG. What the hell is that thing? Why did I just do Fire Breath on this guy? That makes no sense. Why would I... That was an accident. I didn't mean that. Yeah, I'm, I'm trolling. Now, now, the whole jokes ain't funny according to Jack, guys. One more toe out of line from you. And you are going to bed tonight with no supper. And that's a promise. I just could wait, did I just confuse this guy? When has that ever happened? Must be my new weapon I bought earlier, maybe. Slapped that guy so hard he didn't know where he was. Um this way? There might be an item over here actually. Oh no, it's just another random hole. We could fight some AOA members. What do you guys think? Should we do it for science? I hate my job, it sucks! Oh my god, it's dumpster. Hey, you want a battle? Oh, wait. I wasn't ready for this. Champions of the digital world. The angel folder. I don't know any angels. Not where I come from. All right, here we go, guys. A random little card battle in the mountain, freezing our toes off, wondering where it all went wrong. Uh, got one more. Okay, one point of white energy. Sure. You want to play like that, I guess. Let's go ahead and draw two cards. Sure. Pew, pew, pew. Uh, not exactly what I'd call a stellar hand. This guy's going to play a bunch of... Uh, ooh, put a card from deck and put one in hand in trash. That's a, no, that's a... That's not a great card, surely. What's he putting in the trash, guys? Patamon. One out of... Dude, that has to be a cheese gimmick. There's no way he's got Patamons in his deck. I'm going to play some... Uh, Digimon here and hope to God that it's enough. He's only got... Good lord in heaven. Uh, chat, we might be screwed. Uh, yep, this is not looking good. So, unfortunately, I can't kill any of his Digimon, so we're going to have to apply this to our Digimon, respectively. Although, I think it might be a little bit doomed. In fact, I think we're just one point shy of defeating this guy. Yikes. 86 to 87, I think we just lose these, unfortunately. We were very close. We only needed one point of damage. Alright. Round one not really going to plan. That was definitely a winnable round though. Kind of sad. Kind of sad. Let's try round two, see if it's any better. Okay. Normally these turns where we can't change his deck in any way, it normally means that we just lose. Choose the Digimon from deck and add it to the hand. We'll fish for Kurosaramon here. Maybe this is enough to give us a boost. If he has any, uh, if he has any rejection cards, we're in a lot of trouble here. The reason we're going to pull Kurosaramon is because we get the triple. All right, our other cards here kind of suck. Hopefully, this is enough. We just have to win in raw power here, and if not, we cry. If he does anything to sabotage us, we're in trouble. You might use that card that just neutralizes the entire field here. I wouldn't be surprised. 
Bring two Anjum onto the fields. Alright, so it's a light versus dark battle showdown here. Pass. Oh my god, like how how would you like what are you supposed to do to beat this? <laughs> oh yeah, just five Anjuman, yeah, cool. What is that summon Exodia? Well, it has to be enough chat. Five Anjumon's a lot of Anjumon's though. I don't think we win these. We get Infernamon. He just gets a Magna Angemon, 90 over 99. Uh, yep. I think that's called getting destroyed in the anus. We almost round, we all, we almost won round one. If we had gotten one Undo Eclipse, we could have maybe beat this guy in round three. Oh well, we win, we lose. Alright, up the mountain we go. I think we have to drop down here, right? Lots and lots and lots of holes around this area. Get some boosters from Cardmon the next time you grind. Thanks, Lewis. Thank you. Amazing. Are the AOA Grunts holding Nightsticks or Tasers? Either way, that's a rather dark detail I somehow only just noticed. They're glow sticks for the rave. They just haven't cracked them yet. Hey, an item! This is the one Fatal must have been talking about. 3,000 bits. Amazing. Hey, did you man? Hey, did you man? We made it, guys, all the way to the battle gates in the north sector. Hello? Wait. Why are you standing here, man? I was hoping to save my game before I came in here. You wouldn't. You wouldn't do anything bad to me, would you? Any chance I could just walk around you, sir? Any chance I could just, uh, you know? Oh. You're the one interfering with the AOA, going now to see the chief. He wants you to battle with you. Okay, thanks. Was an ominous random dude just standing there? Hmm. Alright, we made it. Good news is, guys, we can now save our game and pick up some stuff. Hey, did you man? Hey, did you man? The boss is... Is he in here? Yeah, we got the ladder. Okay, cool. Let's see what this amazing item is. A supercharge. A Kulon shield. Actually not bad, I think. Maybe that's good for... It's probably for Agamon, honestly. But I will check to see if Monmon can wield it. He's got a two-handed weapon, actually, so I don't think he can. Kulon Shield. 402 defense, and it actually gives him speed as well. Sturdy and light al uh, alloy shield. Interesting. Eventually, we might go back to one of these on Agamon if his strength continues to grow. Might actually not be so bad. He's got this sword, this um, max stat sword at the moment, but ideally with Agamon, we technically could raise his stats up to 999. I wanted to see... I take his... Uh, I take his weapon off. What does he actually drop down to? He goes down to 598. The sword gives him 500 damage. <laughs> oh... Goodness gracious. Alright, sweet. Alright guys, boss time. Let's see if we can't pull it off. Our final of the city bosses, Amaterasu edition. We've defeated all four on the regular server. This is our last one of this server. I don't know if we have what it takes, but I'm going to give it my best shot. Let's see. Hmm, so you have reached here. I should have known from the defeat of the others. Um, Hello. You have the black ID, but I'm not going to try and fire that out. Yes, I do. Do you want it? Then fight with me and take it from my hands. You betcha. This looks a like a tiny little plinth for battling someone. I don't really see this happening. All right, guys. Give me your energy. We're going in. Bolt one. Pretty sure this guy is weak to electric damage or water damage. Renamon would have been good here. Fortunately, we are not in Renamon mode at the moment. First attack lands and does a lot of damage by the looks of things. Yep. Now we just need to look for some blocks. Tomahawk also does a lot of damage right back at us. I don't even think we risk it here. I'm going to just Terror Destroyer again. We may end up losing Black War Greymon if this doesn't connect. It does connect. Okay, good. That's really good. Now what we're looking for is to either go first here or... 
Skull Mammoth Mon, wow, that's awesome. We either need to go first here or we need to lock it. It's a lot of damage, surely. We're barely alive though. Great time for us to use a full heal on Agu, bro. And uh, we might be blasting, boys. I think we're about to. Let's see what we can do. How much damage are we talking here? Not a lot. I think we're about to blast. Maybe not this turn, but next turn. Can we survive a hit is the question. This is very greedy what I'm about to do, but I'm going to look for it anyway. There's always a chance that we evade. I'm going to throw this at him. There's no way Mammoth Mon is a fast Digimon. I think he's probably going to be tankier more than anything. Just need to survive? Maybe? Just shy of being able to survive that one, unfortunately. Let's try and give Sakuyamon some love here. Sakuyamon not seen a lot of action. Let's go Mammoth, Mammoth Mon a little bit scary here, but um, maybe we can pull something off. I think my best chance is to use Grand Wave and hope that it connects. Let's use Grand Wave and hope it connects. Doesn't kill him. Doesn't even come close to killing him. At least tell me we're not tight. Okay, that's a lot of damage. Um, I don't know if I should be using like Snowstorm on this guy instead. Please? He's still alive. I needed to get two turns there. Or we could just block it like an absolute giga chat. Alright, this is this is cool actually. This works. We supercharge here. Ideally I'd get another block turn if possible. I can bring back Agamon, that'd be real nice. Oh, this is so good. I'm gonna bring back uh Agamon so he gets some XP. He really wants XP against these guys. Now when he attacks me, we blast. I'm gonna pop off. Sakuyamon, take it away. Nice suit. Alright, here we go. Have a good day at work. Got to go. Have work. At, uh, bye, Blue Crew. Love you, Blue Crew. Hell yeah. Hmm. Messiah. Sorry, Messiah. You asked the question about the sponsor. Give me one second, homie. I'm going to help you out right away. Where does it... When it says your score, like the goals, reach score 11k. All I see is my power, but I can't... Yeah, yeah. It's okay. It's okay, Messiah. So, Messiah, what um what chapter are you on at the moment, Messiah? What level is your your castle? Because that affects it. Up at mine, what's up? Let's try this. It's a good question, Messiah. Your power level only becomes of your score only becomes available through your power. You know the power button. If you click the power button and you can see a score, then that's oh god. Up at mine done a lot of damage there. I'll show you in a minute, homie. My castle's in the middle of turning to 14 or 15. I think it's... I can't remember what exact level it is. But I'll, uh, I'll let you know in a second. Give me one moment. Basically, the big... You know the big bar that's your power level? When you click that, it'll show you your score. If you can't see it yet, it just means you haven't unlocked it. But it means your, your, your score is still building. You just uh, won't be able to see it straight away. I think it becomes available after you get your castle to a certain level. We can have a look at it in a second. What chapter are you on, Messiah? Do you know off the top of your head? Do you know what chapter you're in? Like, on the right-hand side of your screen, what's the little box say? Complete chapter what? Hey, nice one, guys. We got it. Feels good, man. So, Agamon gonna get 472 XP, which is great. Big level up for him. We really needed that. And Renamon as well. Should see a bit of a bolster here as well. Fantastic. All right, boss defeated. Fanatic are getting pumped. Oh, no. Yeah, I won against the uh, the chief. Hmm. I've got the black ID pass as well, so that's all that's left is to go to Amaterasu City. Let's go. Oh, is it going to take me straight there? Oh, that would have been too good to be true. <laughs> why, why, why did I get my hopes up there? Like the game actually cared about me. Okay. Um. Fine. Absolutely fine, guys. Boss defeated. XP gained. Level ups were had. Gonna just punch in a save file here. Right, I think we wrap up the stream here, guys. We have to make a little journey, so we're gonna travel back down the mountain to 
the Amaterasu Asuka server. I think we can do that from here, hopefully. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the circuit board while I have you guys, rather than saving the game and stopping here. I think we try and make our way through this to get to the Wind Prairie, and then save at the inn, and then that'll be a good point to continue. We can maybe even continue later tonight if you guys want. Or we can leave it for Saturday, I don't know. I'll wait and see how I feel. Let's just get through this for the time being. Maybe this takes us to Kickin' Forest if we're lucky, boys. Fingers crossed. <gasps> Wind Prairie Amaterasu? Beautiful. Well done, guys. We made it. Uh, do we want to do any training before we go into the city here, or do we want to just commit? I'm wondering if we want to just grab a couple of fights. I just don't want to fight Abiterimon. Let's go down to the water, see if we can get some aquatic fights. This might be better. Do, 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 do. Love to see people moving up in life, says Cody. Hell yeah. That's what it's all about, Cody. That's what it's all about. Good. Very good, guys. Nice start to the Saturday. Doing good. Was playing some V Rising last night. Good time. I, did you enjoy it, Jesse? V Rising is a pretty good time. It's true. Singed, right? I'll check VOD in a few minutes. I got a pentakill yesterday on stream. You'll see it. Okay, you got a pentakill. It wasn't on Singed, I'm afraid. But Jinx kind of looks like a bald man anyway, so... I guess not too far from the truth. When do we get Arcane Season 2, guys? That must be soon, right? Arcane must be out soon. Oh man, come on. Mega Siegemon, don't do me like this. Not even a drop of sweat. Let's get Sukuyumon's moves and Canandramon's moves, guys. And then we'll go into Asuka. Does that sound like a good idea? And that way we can kind of relax in the meantime. Need to get up to like level 10, 15, I think. Kind of messed up. All right, let's progress with Digimon today, guys. We're going to go into the actual city here. I'm going to save in the city and we're going to fight through the uh, AOA. I don't know if I can actually go in the door here or not. I think I should be able to get past Nightmon. We've got most of the cards. I'll make a save file just in case. Level 99 on Black War Greymon, guys. Quite possibly. Am I allowed to go in here yet? Okay, we're going into Amaterasu City. Wait, Wolfie, wait a second. Here's Teddy. Teddy, you came over here. Yeah, I came with Lisa and the others. Hey, Wolfie, can you wait a moment before you go in? Lisa's bringing everyone from the Resistance. Then what about the AOA? They've been routed by the Resistance. Once we get the four cities, we only have Amaterasu City left. Okay, I see. So now? Yeah, it's our final battle. We are going to defeat the AOA. This isn't actually the final battle, just so you know. This is like the AOA's showdown final battle, I guess. If we fight together, the AOA is nothing. Alright. If you were to come into this area before doing all of the stuff we've done in the playthrough, guys, you would have been one shot by Nightmon. Nightmon won't resist anymore, says Lisa. Okay, first release the people of this city. Everyone, come on, charge. Who the hell is Chuck? We're not gonna lose to the AOA, yeah. Let's get Amaterasu City back. Uh, whoa, we will definitely win. Yeah, Lisa and the others are here too. But what's happening in the real world? I hope Destramon hasn't started attacking yet. Oh, cutscene. Oh, more cutscenes. Back to the real world. Destramon, you wouldn't. You wouldn't, mate. Uh oh. Godzilla. What an asshole. Mate, couldn't you have just found a new hobby other than destroying the planet? No. Dude. What a cut. That wasn't very nice. A Matarasu bridge. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Terry. That's why we're all fighting. I like how we just watch. We literally just watch the main villain, one of the biggest monsters ever, like, just turn up on a city and blast it to smithereens, and then the main character's like, yeah, don't worry about it, Teddy, it's fine. We're gonna defeat the AOA! Yeah, you're right, we're almost there, let's go! Actually, I wanna go and see if I can buy the special manual from down in Datamon's area. What, are you guys still here? Hello, Nick. Are you two still living? Oh, Nick! This is very casual. What's our situation? It's, uh, it's good! AOA inside the city surrendered quickly. Then the city? 
Oh, we've got it back already. That was fast. Then the only administration center is left. That's where we need to go. What? Then we don't have a chance to beat them up. That's why we came to get you. We want you to help in the attack on the center. All right, leave it to me. I won't lose. Teddy, I'm going to go ahead. Be careful. I'll be right there. So is this going to put me just inside the city? I think we should be able to save our game and stuff here. Lisa, I'm glad everything went well so far. There's still the admin center. Good luck, Wolfie. Right, what I want to do, is there's, there's a few things. I'm actually going to quickly backtrack here really quickly, guys. I'm going to buy some heals. In fact, I'm not going to buy heals at all. I'm going to heal with Gatomon. And then we're going to save our game, and then we're going to go and shop for a little bit. before <laughs> We're going to go buy some stuff before we go too deep into the story. What I am terrified is that it's been so long since I played, and this might not happen. I'm worried that when we beat the next part of the game, the game's going to throw us back out of the Amaterasu server. Now, I don't think it would do that, admittedly, but it might. I'm just going to go and see if I can buy some items. Because apparently the store of the Amaterasu is really good. And then we also want to buy the improved training manual as well. Which is down next to Datamon. I don't know. It's not actually called a training manual. I think it's the Platinum Pass or something. I want to go talk to Piximon and the Professor if possible. Let's see if these guys have any stuff going on. Oh, we can't go this way. Ah, okay. So we're not allowed to go in there. Am I allowed to go through you? Hola, amigo. Guess not. All right. So we can't. We don't have to worry about the uh, the auction house at the moment. So that's that solved. But buying items is something we definitely maybe want to try. It might just be that all the shopkeepers and stuff are actually still Oinkmon because we do have to trans. We're gonna change them back soon, but it might just be that we can't buy anything at the moment. Where's your shop? Can we buy? Ah, <laughs> these guys aren't turned into pigs. Bit bizarre. Kaboom! This is the armory. Let's see what's available here. Do we have anything that is improved for the guys? We've got the Belial Fang, which is 756. This is getting better. It gives a bunch of speed to Agamon. Theoretically, if we could get two of these. Might actually be alright. The Orochi Spear, not really that great. The Gulf Sword gives less speed, but a lot of charisma to Agamon. Millennium for Renamon gives us... I'm trying to see what her actual magic stat is. 779. For thirty thousand, that's almost half of our half of our bank balance. What else have we got here? The Positron Cannon is a new item for Monmon, Mon, but not really that great. Agamon could get the Glorious Crown, which would give him a bunch of stuff, defense and whatnot. All of these are reducing our uh, Apocalypse. Gives Agamon a huge debuff to his strength. Gives him a lot of protection. Crimson Mail for Agamon seems like a decent buy. Gives him four armor, but again, quite expensive. Let's buy it. Probably not totally worth. I didn't actually check Agamon's stats to see what this is doing for him. Let's buy it. I'm going to try and go down the dive point here, guys, just as a weird side passage because, again, I don't know if this area is available right now, but I kind of want to go check. It could be that when I go down here... Maybe that this Datamon might also be a pig or something, I don't know. Um, Agamon's attack is, is not anywhere close to 999 without weapons. If it was, then I would buy the two-handed weapons and get some utility in there. Sleep, Confuse, Poison, whatever I could get. Maybe some heals. But uh, Agamon's strength at the moment is only, it's like 500. The weapon he has right now is giving him a lot. It's like doubling his damage, basically. So uh, if we train Agamon up later on to the point where he gets a lot of strength, then maybe, yeah, we could potentially unequip his two-handed sword and put two swords on him to give him some bonuses, but for the time being, that's not possible for us. I'm too busy putting training points in other parts of Agamon, like his speed and stuff. Hmm. Does that, does that sound good? The problem with this game is that the two-handed is too good, but I can feel you can make a more well-rounded character without it. Or you can... I mean, we've talked about this before, guys. This was mentioned earlier in the playthrough, and you guys might not know this. But the fact that the two-handed weapons in this game is are so strong... Uh, this has come from my Twitch chat throughout the playthrough this time, by the way. I don't know if it's true, but there's a rumour that the reason the two-handed weapons are so strong is actually because of a development bug. It was because of a mistake made in development. Apparently, when they were coding 
the weapons for or programming the weapons for this game, they didn't anticipate the fact that the two-handed weapons take up both your hand slots, which is why they do double damage. So the two-handed weapons aren't supposed to be this strong. Or so I'm told. It's actually by accident that they're twice as powerful. They're supposed to be half as powerful. <gasps> oh. Big Daddy War G, what's up? Are you gonna wipe the floor with me? Oh my goodness. You are a dark type Digimon, and I think that your weakness is holy damage, but I don't actually have any holy damage on me. I would assume it's holy damage. Hey, dude. Hey, I'm Blackboard Greymon. We uh, welcome Courageous Tamer. Fight with me. Do I have a choice? Sure, I'll fight you. You seem to have guts. <laughs> I like how there's like no hesitation. There's no ask. There's no are you sure. It's just fight me and I'll kill you. I'll show you my powers. Very well, let's begin. I have no idea how powerful this guy is. I have no idea. I, he could be really strong, he could be really weak. He's probably not going to be weak, let's be honest. Please don't block this. The fact we went first is very good. I thought he was going to go first. Hey, that's not bad. We did 999 damage. He's going to tear a destroyer us right back. Probably one shot is right. Maybe we can block these? How much, how much, how much, how much? It's just a my War Greymon versus your War Greymon. It's like that bit at the end of Metal Gear Solid where they're on top of Metal Gear Rex just punching each other. Just psh, 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 psh. Dude, I think we win these. I think we win these unless he crits me. Dude, it's a showdown of the big daddies. <laughs> Come on, Agamon. You got this, dude. Bring it home. Assert dominance. There can be only one. Hey, Michael, what's up? Michael No One. I like your name. Shoutouts to the uh, missing no glitch in Pokemon. I'm assuming that's what it is. Michael, how are you? Welcome. All right, nice. We did nine, 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 nine damage. Black War Greymon defeated. This is gonna be great XP for Agamon. Five hundred and thirty. You love to see it. I don't know if that's enough to take us to level forty, but it should be a lot. A thousand bits gained for the fight. And the champion, the the mega XP is a little wasted here, but that's all right. Hey, dude, I guess you're not all talk. Of course, I've gotten through all kinds of trouble like this. I like you. Take this with you. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is what we came for. I got the platinum ID. Is he going to tell us what that does? Aim to be the strongest. I think that's the clue. That is the secret to becoming a great tamer. So I think the platinum ID, from my understanding... From my understanding, that should give us enhanced training, I think. But I don't know if it works everywhere. Let's go test it on Panjumon's gym and see what we have access to in terms of training. I did not... I didn't even remember he was there, to be honest, but... Good. Very good. Hey, dude. This is the training gym. I'm not going to go easy on you. Not a single comment remark made. <clears throat> and we do actually have all enhanced training across the entire board, guys. So now, no matter where we go, no matter what gym we use, we can get enhanced training and all of it is buffed. That is absolutely and utterly delicious. So we have 10 TP on Agamon. It would be really silly not to use it. Um, we could do what you guys were talking about and put points in Agamon's strength so that we can take those weapons off him, give him some other stuff. But I think, honestly, there's no reason why we wouldn't want to just train his speed and just get him as much block and, and speed as possible. So here we go, guys. 10 TP for Agabro. We have to hope that he pulls this off. Come on, Agamon. Do it, little homie. Uh oh, not too good. We have five goals at this because it's enhanced. That's a fail. Agamon, come on, man. You had such a good start here. Not again. Agamon! No way are you going to do that. The Platinum ID pass, eh? Have I been sold a fraudulent device? Agamon, what the hell was that? Agamon, what the heck was that? You should be disgusted with yourself. After your... Fantastic showdown against Black War Greymon. You can't make it over a fucking skipping rope, you dumbass. Right. Um, disappointing. Let's go ahead and buff Renamon. What are we going to do with Renamon? Is it speed? I'm nervous now, after what I just witnessed. Maybe we do more wisdom? So sh no, we're going, we're going damage, guys. We're going damage. We're going max spirit on Renamon. As much power as possible. Renamon, please don't let me down. Good. I'm sensing. Okay, better. Yep. We're going all in, guys. Ultra challenge. Come on, Renamon. One time. I believe in you. 
Excellent. Okay, Agamon slipped a little bit. Renamon picked up the pieces. That's going to be a huge buff to our damage, guys. 86 spirit. Absolutely phenomenal. And then Monmon, Mon, you're chilling. We don't have to train you. We'll hang on to his 5 TP. Alright, a little bit disappointed in Agamon. If I'm being completely honest, but it's fine. Let's go and save, I guess. Now that we've got the ID. We'll do a heal and then we'll progress. I'm pretty sure Wargreymon's going to appear soon. And then we can use the city to rearrange our Digimon. Have a look at the other Digivolutions we unlocked. In fact, I kind of want to do that now. We'll do, we'll do it later. We'll do it later. We did unlock some new Digivolutions. Two, two new Digivolutions for Renamon and one for Monmon. I think Monmon can now turn into Greymon, which is hilarious. We've got some AOA to punch through, guys. We've got a little bit of AOA to punch through. Let's see if we can get this part of the, the game done. Hey, guys. Want to fight me? You want to fight? I won't let anyone get past here. I won't let anyone get in the way. Our beautiful world is going to come to life soon. All right, here we go. Showdown time. Apparently everybody in the city has left this area available for us to come in and just clap cheeks, so... Why that's the case or not, I don't know. Here's here's Black War Greymon with his plus 11 points in speed. Mm. My brother wanted me to do a Minecraft server a long time ago when he was really into Minecraft. I don't know if he still plays it. Maybe, guys, maybe. I've never really played much Minecraft. I could get into it. I could get addicted. Maildromon, how tanky are you? Pretty tanky by the looks of things. Okay, did that... <laughs> did that just say Maildromon is serving dinner? What the actual fuck? What, why did it say that? He's confused, obviously, but like, that's hilarious. Is this the best that AOA has to offer? David, welcome. Hello. Happy Saturday to you. Happy Saturday. David, thanks. I really appreciate that. Thank you for continuing to support me and expand our community, guys. It really feels amazing. Hope everybody's doing excellent, and I hope you are having a fantastic afternoon. Right, we were supposed to go this way, but I think if we do some of these optional fights, not only will we gain XP, but we should also uh, gain some extra items, maybe? Potentially? I'm just going to keep using my most powerful move, guys. It's a little bit cheesy, but... We know that Terra Force is really good on Maildrum, Maildrum on here, so there's no reason not to use it. Just colossally strong. What I'm looking to do here is get Agamon to level 40. So that's the reason I'm using Agamon. I know Black War Greymon is max level 99, so this is kind of wasting XP on him. But it's a really easy way to get Agamon leveled up fast. So as soon as we get regular War Greymon, we can start training him. And we'll have a little bit of variety in the playthrough. All of this week, my thumbnail on YouTube has been Black War Greymon. But we want to change that soon, so. I like having strong Digimon, but I also like adding a bit of spice. We want to change the playthrough as we go through, right? It kind of looks like we're one-tricking our way through the game with just this powerhouse clapping cheeks. But honestly, our whole team is coming into coming into form. Even Renamon's starting to pop off now that Sakuyamon's on board, so. Nice. Fantastic. Hey, Messiah, how's it going? What's up, dude? <clears throat> Backtracking? Back smacking? We're attacking? Skills we ain't lacking? And you guys are... Cracking. Is this the game? Never. Well, also because the game gets super grindy and a bit boring if you play too much, this cherry. I play locally with my housemate. Oh, nice. Minecraft. Jack Reads here says, go easy on Agamon, his back is tired from carrying you three through DW3. How's it going, Jack? I'll make you regret ever coming here. Gargamon wants to be Machine Dramon so bad. He's trying, guys. He's trying his best. I'm glad we're able to clear through these fights really quickly and easily. This part of the game is the exact same part of the game we played earlier when we were in the regular Asuka City. In the regular Asuka server. And uh, we just have to plow through a bunch of AOA units. There's The ones I'm fighting right now, I think, are the additional fights. You don't have to go this way. I'm just doing it for the XP and the items. I think there's money down here. Now that I know I don't have to buy the upgraded Platinum ID Pass for the training, then we can pretty much chill. I'm glad the dumpster told me that was there, because if you hadn't, we'd 
I'd never, I wouldn't even know about it. I wouldn't think to go down there and fight Black War Greymon. That's another game randomly. I know I'm firing topics at you left, right, and center here, but that's another game I was thinking about replaying through at some point. So, I, I mentioned earlier, the game I was thinking of was Oblivion. To finish that ch chain of thought. Or train of thought. Because I finished my new books, guys, last night, I started a new series. Uh, so I finished the First Law trilogy, which is um, Blade Itself by Joe Aber Abercrombie. And I was thinking about what book I wanted to play next, or what game I... What book I wanted to listen to next, Jesus. <laughs> and I decided to opt in a new fantasy book that I've been eyeing on up for a while, and the Billy told me was uh, quite good. So I got um, the John Gwynn novel, which is called... I've had a phone call. Who had a phone call from? No one important. Um, the book is called... I think it's War of the... Oh, Shadow of the Gods. Book one. And the setting of this is like a kind of Norse mythology. And it's got like kind of snow and little villages and there's yarls. It's got a kind of Viking-y kind of theme to it. And all it's making me think of when I'm listening to it is Skyrim. And I'm thinking, man, I kind of want to do a Skyrim playthrough now. It's all like axes and shields and wooden fortresses and little villages. And then there's these giant beasts that roam around. I was like, damn. Maybe we were doing an Elder Scrolls playthrough of some kind. I've been listening to a lot of books recently, right? Lots and lots because I'm a nerd. Don't tell anyone. Okay. And what I've been doing is over the last like three years since I started doing audiobooks all the time, I've been dipping my toe into pretty much every single fantasy series that Audible has thrown at me. So what I'll do is I'll I'll get a recommendation for a fan for a fantasy book, right? And then I'll listen to book one. And when I listen to book one, I ha I then have a choice. I've got a fork in the road. I'm like, do I go into book two of the series or do I try a new one? And when I go on to look and spend my little token, there's like a bunch of books that come up. So, the last few books I've listened to, I'll, I'll go through these. Maybe you guys, I don't know if you guys are big book readers or not. Maybe you are, maybe you're not. Try and keep it, try and keep it short. So here's the last books I've read. I, last, I read The Last Argument of Kings, which was Joe Abercrombie. That was the first law. That was a, a weird series. It, was, it had a very kind of gritty ending, in my opinion, where like, you know how sometimes you read a fantasy series and then the good guys win and then they get married and then they're all happy and they have kids and then they settle down and they're rich and they, they laugh about their adventures? This is not that type of series. There was a lot of really sorrowful endings. I, I'll talk about it another time. I read The Last Argument of Kings, The Cuckoo's Calling, which was actually a British detective series. I read, I read Book Warden of that. I'm listening to... <laughs> this is not a series or a novel. Uh, this is like a... One of these kind of like development books. It's never split the difference. It's a book about negotiation. Weird, I know. Don't ask. The Shadow of What Was Lost by James Islington. That was the last fantasy book I listened to. Before that, I listened to The Lies of Locke, Namo Locke Lamora, which is the Gentleman Bastard series. Before that, it was The Blinding Knife by Brent Weeks. That's the Lightbringer series, I think. I dipped my toe into lots of different ones. He Who Fights With Monsters, I listened to that, that was like a literary RPG, like Dungeons and Dragons, but like in story mode. It's kind of bizarre that one, that was a fucking huge ass novel. Then I read some Jack Reacher, then I read Jade War by Fonda Lee, which is like the Greenbone saga. Mistborn by Brandon Sanderson, On the Shoulders of Titans by Andrew Rowe, that's the Sufficiently Advanced Magic series. That's quite good. A little bit woke though. Can't Hurt Me by David Goggins. Again, not exactly a kind of weird novel to throw in here. Reign of Madness by Kel Cade. Uh, that's the Reskin novels where he's like the super assassin, but he doesn't know how to be a normal human. It's bizarre. More Jack Reacher. Oathbringer by Brandon Sanderson. That's Stormlight. And then that's pretty much it. A Man Called Ovi. That's not a fantasy book. That's a book about a sad man in Sweden. And why he's sad. It's actually very sad. I might have teared up while walking in the woods listening to that, but don't tell anyone again. Um, Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I read, listened to Project Hail Mary, which is by, that's like a sci-fi novel. It was alright. Flowers for Algernon. 
That's just like a literary classic. I think everybody should read that. It's very sad. It's going to make you cry. A lot of these are kind of sad, actually. Maybe you shouldn't read Flowers for Algernon, but you should know what it is. A good meaning behind Flowers for Algernon. That shit's... Oof. The Poppy War by R.F. Kang. I started reading that. I finished that for book one of that series. I quite like The Poppy War, but I don't know. And then before that, I read The uh, Last Wish, which is actually the novels attached to The Witcher, so... I've been... Guys, I've listened to... I've consumed a lot. Audible's been getting its fucking value out of me, that's for sure. <laughs> Stubbsy, how's lunch going? Are you winning? At work, but it's going great. Good. Night Angel Trilogy by Brent Weeks is really good. Uh, I'll keep that in mind, Blue Crew. Please be a good item. An Ultra Charge. I would assume that's a full heal for all of my Digimon, is it? Right, I think we defeated these guys. Let's get the heck out of here. Balmorian on a Saturday, Jack? Question mark? Yeah, I'm doing a little bonus stream, Balmorian. I just thought you guys have been pretty crazy recently, so I thought, hell yeah. But that's all the books I've been listening to. Sorry, nobody asked. Nobody asked. I feel like that's when you get in the uh, car for a four-hour road trip with your uncle and he's like, listen to this band that I love from the 80s and they puts on like the 12-hour mixtape and you're like, wait a minute. I didn't ask for this, Uncle Ronnie. Um, but yeah, no, I've, sorry. You're welcome, chat. I'm going to go and get some MP for Agamon here. Been getting getting through the Broken Earth trilogy by N.K. Jemison, says Enigma. Let me add that one. What's book one called, Enigma? Tell me what book one's called and I'll add it to my wish list. I've got a lot of books on my wish list. The fifth season by N.K. Jemison. The good news is it's on Audible. Let's have a look at the reviews, shall we, Enigma? 1.8k, 4.5 out of 5 stars. That's pretty good. The Broken Earth series, book one. I'm adding it to the list. Book one, how many is there? Four titles, that's fine. Sometimes I'll look up a fantasy series that you guys recommend and I'm like, oh, book one sounds really good. Let's have a look and see how many books there are. 50 books in the series. You're like, how the fuck am I going to get through that? That's a library, bro. But you're okay. You know, I'm thinking of the Wheel of Time. You guys know what I'm talking about. Did anybody ever start Wheel of Time, anyone? No? I remember I had a mate once. I used to drive to work with him. And he was like, have you read the Wheel of Time? And I was like, I've heard of it, you know, pretty good. It's like, yeah, there's like a hundred no, no, there's not a hundred novels, but you know what I mean. I'm going to add this to my wish list, Enigma. Enigma, if this book one is bad, I'm going to slide tackle you. Just kidding, love you. All right, so that was that book. Brittany, what did you suggest? What was your one? The Ninth Rain. The Ninth. Okay, it popped up straight away. Jen Williams. It'd be so funny if this was Britney's own book or something. Eh? Imagine this was Britney's book. She's like, Jack, read this. <laughs> okay, book one, the ninth reign, the Winnowing Flame Trilogy. 20 hours long, 4.5 stars out of 5. Less reviews, narrated by Jot Davies. Okay. Let's add that to the wish list. Okay. Britney, if this is bad, I'm going to slide tackle you. Okay, good. Fantastic. Did I get any of those wrong? Is that good? is that bad? Thank you for the gifted. Hell yeah, dude. Brittany just swannies in, you know? We're all sitting have a drink at the pub and Brittany just kicks the door in. Kicks the door off its fucking hinges. Yeah, but Jack, have you read this book? <laughs> Brittany, hi! They were out of milk. She better had a lot of milk with her now after that time. It's nice to see you guys. I never... I, see, I always get caught, guys. I'm being... I'm going to be... When you guys come back after a hiatus, obviously, first of all, that's totally normal. I do that with streams all the time. When I go to people's streams or, like, you know, if I'm watching a YouTube channel, sometimes I'll watch a series religiously and then, you know, I know what it's like. Life gets in the way. you got to do other stuff. Twitch is like a pastime for a lot of people. So, like, dipping in out of communities is something I do all the time, but... I always want you guys to feel welcome when you come back, but I also feel like sometimes I might be making it a little bit weird. So I'm caught between like trying to be friendly, but also not being like, you know, a, a bonobo. But yeah, it's good quality. She milked the cow herself. Guys, listen. Okay, Brittany went out to get milk three years ago. Okay, you don't need to keep bringing up the milk jokes. Three years, no milk, no milk, guys. Anyways... Expeditionary Force is 16 books so far by Craig Allison. Danny, is that worth... I feel like a 16 novel series is a bit too much for me. 
Because I like a lot of these novels, guys. I like reading, I like listening and all that, but... 16 novels? Motherfucker will be writing some Shakespeare for me to get in a si 60 novels? Danny, is it good? Is it a good series? Is it fun? That's a commitment, man. That's like a mortgage. What if it's bad? No, I guess you could try book one and then take it from there. 16 books. Somebody's not stopped writing those. If it's bad, I'll just go out for milk again. Nice. Okay, okay. Deal. 20 minute adventure in and out three years later. <laughs> Brittany, we've been counting the days! No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Hope life's been treating you well, Brittany. It's great to see you. Are you still doing all your usual stuff? All the normal th things that Brittany would do? I don't even remember what games we were playing last time. Talking about books will always summon a Brittany. You spoke the forbidden words. What other books did you guys say? Alpha. Alpha, welcome. Alpha, have you been here for a while, Alpha? Have I spoke to you today? I've been doing a lot of rambling. Alpha, thank you so much for hitting the goal on our sponsor. You're an absolute hero. We're blasting. Right, hold on. Somebody else gave me a book. Journeyed to the Dark Tower. I'm looking. I'm looking. Hold on. Give me a hot minute. Journey to the Dark Tower. Is this the series to Jurassic Park? Just kidding. Journey... Journey to the West. That's not what we're looking for. Not at this moment in time. Uh, so, Brittany, out of all these books, The Ninth Reign is the best one. Is that, is that what you're telling me? I need to the Dark Tower. Oh my god, I cannot spell and it's starting to hurt me. Dude, I don't know if it's actually... Is it on Audible, Alpha? How new is the Dark Tower? Is that an old series? Oh no, it is. Wait, is it just called the Dark Tower, is it? Is it called To the Dark Tower? No. Dark, Psycholo Dark Psychology Secrets by Robert Tower. No, that's not what we're looking for. Am I just an idiot? I can't find it. Two Guys to the Dark Tower Came, a podcast about Stephen someone? Stephen King? Wait, surely that should be here. How can I not find this? Oh, the Dark Tower. One oh yeah, Gunslinger. Is it Gunslinger? Is that number one? Alpha, am I being a big bonobo? The Dark Tower series, book one, Gunslinger, 4.2 stars out of 5 alpha. Although it does have 4,000 reviews. Is this going to be a- Oh, wait, this is the Idris Elba movie! Dude, this is the- Oh, they made a movie about this, did they not? Oh, yeah! Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm adding book one. Eight titles! Alpha, what are you signing me up for here? Stephen King's magnum opus. Masterfully mixes horror fantasy in the Wild West. I'm adding book one. Alpha, you know the rules. Slide tackle. All right, I'm adding the Dark Tower series to my list. Guys, can we do little three? Can we do three book series from now on? That's this is a lot. You guys are giving me a lot of homework. Hmm. The Ninth Reign is the one I think most neutral without knowing what flavour of books you enjoy most. Oh, it's like the safe bet. Yeah, Brittany, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Hey, we turned into a Grand Kawagamon, by the way. Look at this, Chad. Okay, thank you guys. Thank you for all the book recommendations. I will endeavour to try. I'll, I'll finish listening to John Gwynn, but I'm quite enjoying it so far. I'm only on Chapter 4. I like that the main ca one of the main characters is called Orca. That is incredibly badass. The Book of Eli. That was a good movie. Is that based on a novel? It probably is, right? The Book of Eli is a movie you guys should all watch. Because it's a standalone. And it's got Denzel Washington in it. Denzel Washington in it and he's the best. Creepy Mon just blocks my attack. Do we ever lose here? But one that I absolutely loved is Priory of the Orange Tree. Absolutely loved it, Brittany. You're playing your full hand here. You're all in. If I read this and it's bad, 
I've, I've got a strong suspicion we'll never speak again. Hold on. Hold on. River Enchanted is a sweet treat. Okay, hold on. This is to slow it down. Priori. I'm an old man here. I'm trying my best. Priority of the Orange Tree by Samantha Shannon. Okay, okay, okay. Book 1. 4.1 out of 5. These ratings are getting worse, Brittany. I'm just saying. No, that's 1.3k. The artwork look, looks good. The Roots of Chaos Book 1. Oh, there's only two in the series. We can work with that. Wait, there's a book 0 0.5. Should I read book 0 0.5 before I go into book 1, Brittany? On the orange tree. Apparently, there's a book 0 0.5 that's 40 hours long. How can you have a book 0 0.5 and it be 40 hours long? I love Denzel Washing Machine. Blue Crew, don't call him that. Have you read the book called Drag These Nuts by Jack's Face? I'm adding book one. I'm adding book one of the Priory of the Orange Tree to the list by Samantha Shannon. And if that's naughty, I'm going to slide tackle Brittany and Samantha Shannon at once. A river enchanted. Okay, hold. I was enchanted to meet you two by Rebecca Ross. Daughter of Bob Ross. Okay. Series the elemental uh, the elements of cadence, book one. Okay, okay, okay. I'm adding to the list. Brittany, it's added. Anybody else got any recommendations while we're here? I heard that book drags on. Jack Reed, don't enable Fatal One Hundred One. Okay, are we good? My favourite president is George Washing Machine. Guys, stop making puns on the word wash. Okay, it's not funny. That's not even remotely amusing. We're listen. This is a serious topic. I'm, I'm this guys. I get one audible token a month. One, one audible token a month. That book has to. It's got to be good. Now I've got two tokens at the minute, but that's a secret. I'm not going to reveal to you guys. What? If I buy a book and it's bad, that's me. Thirty days of pain. Stuck listening to this, that, and the next thing. You know. So, uh, well, I'm just saying, I know I just asked you guys for casual recommendations. You didn't think it was gonna, there was going to be a blood contract, but I, I'm just letting you guys know the football pitch that we're playing on. Did you all learn Wargreymon eventually feels good, man? Did you all slot fill? That's fine. Okay, now we can swap Agabro back out. Don't read a day of nightfall. Uh, read a day of fall night first. You have to do priority first. Okay, don't read that one. Okay. Priori priority is... Priory. I don't know why I can't say that word. I've added that one to the list. That's the one I added. That's washest. Anyways, moving swiftly on at an alarming pace. We're going to get through this part of the game, hopefully. Are you guys with me? Do, 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 do. Where are we going this way? I praise you for coming this far, but do you really think you can defeat us? I mean, either my Sakuyamon's gonna one-shot you, or she's gonna die. One of the two, and I'm not really quite sure what. Alright, do we want to go with against the machine guy? Maybe water? Is this good, guys? Maybe? Is he even machine type? I don't know. Maybe that's big damage, yeah. Oh! -ho! Dude, Dumpster would be so proud of me right now. Wisdom, damage, or accuracy? Uh, so... Spirit, which is the top one, Blue Crew, is damage, and then Wisdom is how much you, how many your accuracy for landing magic attacks and how much you dodge magic attacks. It's like a two-in-one Kanto type. Of, oh my lord! And I think we're gonna be okay, chat. We're gonna be okay. Electric on the machine type, yeah. Electric on the machine type. All in favor, CI. He never blocks these. That's a one shot. Don't get up. Okay, nice. <laughs> Water on machine. Guys, I'm starting to get hungry. It's only half past three. I had a bacon bagel for my breakfast lunch today. It's not quite cutting the mustard, you know? It could only take me so far. I'm growing, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm growing, you know? Arms are sore. Alright. I'll get back to you in like 
Brenty, when I see you in like six years, I'll uh, let you know what I thought of the books, yeah? <laughs> I need to finish the John Gwynn one that I've just started last night. I only started it lying in my bed last night. AOA will not lose. I will prove it to you right now. But so far it's good. So far it's been quite well. It's good. It's good. Hmm. Are you guys getting fed up of um, fighting Maeldramon over and over again? Because I kind of am. At least we have the damage to kill him. Bonk. Wait, we don't have the damage to kill him, I lied. Hold. Oh no, wait, you wouldn't. We're okay, right? Okay. Oh no. I'm pretty sure we were supposed to save our power moves for the boss. We didn't calculate this. What's this guy's name? Guys, you know this Digimon here, right? That one? That's like... Do you know what I think to myself when I see this, honestly? You know when you're a little kid and you think you've got the best Halloween costume and you go around like really impressed with yourself, showing it to people when in reality it's really bad? I feel like that Digimon is my Halloween costume when I was like six years old. Like I thought I was terrifying and menacing and in reality I just looked like a fucking... I don't know. I'm not even gonna say what I was about to say. I kind of feel like that's what that Digimon is. It's like a, it's like my bad Halloween costume when I was a child. Malo my Otismon, yeah, yeah. You guys all know his name. Sorry. Where, what is um, what is Malo my Otismon from, guys? What uh, what series of Digimon is he from? I feel like it's gonna take nine, six years to get through priority on Audible. Well, Brittany, do you? I don't know. Do you listen to Audible or do you just read the books? You just do it the the regular personal way where you just sit with the book. I've got a tr I've got a trick with Audible to get through books that are big and bulky because a lot of these fan AOC novels are big and bulky. You just put it on one times two or one times five speed, and because you know it depends on the reader, it depends on the the narrator. But like, maybe this is sacrilege, Brittany, because I've got a vague something in the back of my mind is telling me that you did like audio related stuff as part of your job so maybe this is gonna hurt your feelings i don't know but like i put it on one if there's a slow reader i just put it on one times two and it makes it like what it does is it will show you the total time to read the book right and let's say it's like 40 hours to finish the, the book when you put it to 1.2 it shaves like seven hours off of it so i normally just listen to them like that but i read the books like a pleb no that doesn't make you a pleb <laughs> i read books like a pleb Said every wise person ever. No, that's not that's not bad. Season two. Season two had Venom my Otis one. Guys, I finished season two earlier this year. What do you mean? No. Oh. Yeah, no, actually, I think you guys are right, actually. Wait, because I was expecting them to turn into Venom my Otis Mon. But he turned into Mallow my Otis Mon. No, I don't think... No, Season 2 doesn't have Venom my Otismon, because I was waiting on it, Stubbsy. Hmm. I like how you guys are like, Season 2, Season 2, Season 2. I'm on Episode 20 of Season 3 at the moment. Uh, it was the episode where the old Renamon goes off with the Bull Guy, and the Bull Guy's like, Join me, Renamon. You are too powerful for these shitters. Join my master. And Renamon's like, uh -huh, No thanks. Uh -huh. And then... They all gang up and kill him. It's actually kind of disgraceful. They kind of ambush him in a way. Because the bull Digimon invites Renamon for a parley. You know, and you'd think that respectfully that should mean that, like, you know, they can talk about it. But then Renamon says, no thanks, bro. And then they all, all of the friends turn up and they gang bang kill the bull. Not a sense I thought I'd say today, admittedly. But, you know, Digimon. Just Digimon things. I've been trying to get through it. Not for, not because it's keeping me intrigued to the maximum. It's because like I want to know how to pronounce the Digimon names because I keep mispronouncing them and then you guys get mad about it. So I'm trying to educate myself. It's kind of like um, you know how like when you work a job, guys, but then they retroactively send you back to get the qualification while you're working there so that they can like whatever. That's what I kind of feel like, you know made so much Digimon content, I'm now going back and doing the degree that I was supposed to do. I'm a fraud. 
Um, did we go this way? Ooh. Why even put that item in the game? Why even put an empty, literally an empty box? Do you own a Kindle? No, Fatal. Uh, I think my sister does. I've never owned a Kindle, no. Kindles are... They were all the rage back in the day. Clearly you weren't paying attention. Mallow Myos 1 in Season 2, Venom Myos 1 in Season 1. He doesn't turn into Venom Myos 1 in Season 1, guys, surely. I think you guys are making that up. I think you guys are making the show up. I don't remember seeing Venom Myosmon in Season 1. I thought it was just regular Myosmon. And then he digivolved into... Um... Stinky Poopy Pants Mon or something. I don't know. Something like that. The last enemy after Christmas. Malo Myotismon was the spirit that was inside that one adult man who was kidnapping children and kinda neglected the message of the show up until that part which I thought that people are the most dangerous monsters in the world. It didn't help that the character had a trench coat as well. Yeah. Anyways. Do you know what the Digimon and the kids prevailed? That's all that matters. Digimon. Myosmon gets pierced by Angie Woman's arrow and dies, then Digivolves later in the Venom Myosmon. Jerry, spoilers. Block it, please. Please block it, please. Ask and you shall receive. Now, take him out. Whew. Too easy. Guys, how did we get this good at the game? So Kuyumon's going to learn a new move at level 25, right guys? Right, right. Nice block. Did you see that, Jack? Calculated. Calculated that. It's been a while since I watched Digimon Stubbs. Yeah, I'll let you off the hook. That, like I said, I'm doing like a rewatch just to catch back up, but... I don't know, guys. You're watching the show, right? I just, I've just come from watching Solo Leveling, where like the characters get a lot done per episode, and there's only 12 total, so it's really not that big of a commitment. There's a lot happening, you know, they're they're powdering through it, they're punching through it. And then I go back to watching Digimon. And it's like, okay, season three, I've just made it through 50 episodes of season one, 50 episodes of season two or whatever. I get into season three and I'm like, alright, cool, another however many goddamn episodes. And I wouldn't mind if, like, there was good stuff happening, but a lot of the time it's like... They'll have a couple of episodes of development. Which is, this is normal, by the way, just, just, I know this is, like, normal for the animes at the time. I'm not saying that they did this bad or anything. I know this was typical of the of the era where these enemies were made, but sometimes they literally just have an episode and it's like just the kids sitting around eating ice cream or something and I'm like, what's happening here? I don't have enough energy for this. It's just the kids sitting around fucking... Dude, there was literally like, okay, last episode I watched, no joke, the kids went to the camp, which was kind of cute in a way, but like... There was a giant fuck off owl sucking electricity out of a power plant. They kicked its ass, it died, and then they went home. And I'm just like. No hate. No hate. I know that's. I know that's pretty typical of the show, but. I was watching it and I'm like, I got 45 more episodes of this. Um. You know? Venom my Otis one was the one that got nuked by Wargreymon in season one, I swear, says Alex. You guys are um, starting to... This is... Do you know what they call this, guys? When people have different remembrance of history. The Mandela effect. You guys are having a Mandela moment. Where uh, you guys are remembering, like, different versions of Digimon. Chat, who's got the real reality? Maybe I wasn't wrong. Ali was critiquing me for not knowing about Veno and when in reality maybe you guys are wrong. Dumpster, tell them that they're wrong. Dumpster, how do I win this fight right now against Piedmon? We're in a duel to the death. I don't know if I have enough damage to kill him. Maybe if I use Dramon Buster it'll work? Maybe that'll do, right? Shit. Dumpster, why? Dumpster, no. Oh, Dumpster. We're not dead, are we? Oh, Dumpster, you clutched it. Nice. Dumpster, you're the best. Shut up, says Ali. Digimon is perfect. 
Ali, do you know what I've learned? Oh, no, he blocked us! We block him, right? Hey, Jack, did you see that? Yes. Ali, I'm going to say yes. Hold. <laughs> We're the best. We're the best. Nice. Guys, did you see that? Wait, are we not are We not done here? Wait, has another Digimon? You wouldn't go first. You're too slow. You're wearing a dress. Fuck. Lock it, please, Monmon, please. Oh, God, it hurts. No. Monmon. Wait, why are all my Digimon dead? Stir. Okay. I can revive. I can revive. It's fine. There once was a person and their name was Alex. Alex, I don't know. I don't have the answers to your, um, to your discussion. I don't know. Sadly, these old TV shows relied on you forgetting what happened last week when you watched it. Or, or, below, or before the ad break. You know... Let's go ahead and Terror Destroyer, this man's bum. Scripted blocks. I just turned on my axe, Fatal. I've turned the mic off. Woo! We blocked these, right? <laughs> just kidding. This is gonna be the best day of my life. Do 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 Get wrecked, idiot. Okay, nice. If I could change anything, I'd simply remove all the recycled footage in order to make a more concise cut of the show blue crew. I was really going to try and change that sentence, but I wasn't quick enough. Could have put anything in that sentence and it would have been so much. It would have been fun, you know? If I could change anything, I'd simply... Oh, I could have sabotaged that sentence, blue crew. That could have been good. Do that again in like a week's time, blue crew, and I'll have another go at it. Apocalymon dubbed is the only good thing to come out of the Digimon show, says RPG Lewis. Lewis, you better be careful. I've just been told that Digimon is perfect. Now, if you guys get in a bar brawl, I'm not getting between you, okay? What's Puppetmon weak to? Snowstorm? Boop. You little ugly snithering bastard. Officer, what was your favourite part in the Harry Potter series? Damn it. Cannon Drummond, come back out to play. 10 4, always the crust, never the pizza. Pardon? Is that like a cryptic clue or something? There's some funny, there's some other funny dubs in the show, it's true. It was a really funny, uh. In the episode with the owl guys that I was talking about, where they killed the giant owl, there was like another, there was another owl. Well, the thing, the thing they killed was like a big peacock or something, I don't know, it was like a fat turkey. And then there was an owl that was talking to them and the, the, the owl had like a randomly like, just out of nowhere had like a New Jersey accent. And it just came out of, came out of nowhere. You guys don't even need me to remind you that Elvis was... The voice actor for Etamon in the show as well, right? Literally. Jcram loves that part. I really wanted to get through this part of the game, honestly. But my goodness gracious. These fights are taking a fucking age. We should be alright, guys, right? Right? I'm not worried about losing to Piedmon, right? Right, guys? Uh, just don't know how to get through this guy. Oh, I... Hey, we're still alive. Do you want to the real answer or a meme one? I'm sure why would you even ask that? What is darkness weak to in this game? Is it holy? Also, why is he blocking all my fucking attacks? What a cretin. Piedmon, you stink. I'm gonna have to res my whole stinking squad. 
I think we're nearly there. I think we're, we're almost there, guys. I just used the wrong item. I'm griefing. Sorry, I used... Oh, no. He wouldn't kill me in two hits, would he? That'd be really bad. Oh, no, we're fine. Wait. Fuck it. You son of a bitch. There's no way he gets three in a row, Ryan. Life disc is what I was supposed to use. Why am I laughing? I'm supposed to be depressed. <laughs> yeah. There you go. <laughs> I can tell as well, like, see when it comes to the, uh... See when it comes to some of the dubbing of Digimon, especially in Season 3 when, it, obviously, the studio had, had a lot of practice at it. I'm assuming it was the same studio that did 1, 2, and 3, because you recognise a lot of the voices. Um... What's really funny is the like the on-the-spot jokes that they make that you just know was not in the Japanese version. Like they throw stuff in there, and I think it probably like just if I was to guess, there was probably just a line that said improv some joke, and, and then they had to come up with it because some of the stuff I'm just like, there's no way the Japanese like version would have had this in it. The little quips that they make is pretty funny sometimes. Lock this, please. Oh no. War Greymon, no! I thought he was going to survive that there. Uh, let's give this to Cannon. The meme is, I tried to watch the Goblet of Fire twice and fell asleep two hours in. The Goblet of Fire is my favourite Harry Potter book. Oh, come on now. Why won't you die? Why won't you die? Guys, everybody knows the Goblet of Fire is the best one. Come on now. And not just because Dumbledore whispered it quietly, okay? Before anybody fucking says that. You're a sleeping wizard, honey. Valky, hello. Sakuyamon is actually level 24. I maybe should have given her a level up to 25. Oh, I did. Never mind, I'm a genius. Can load tech Electro Bolt. That stinks. Yeah, Renamon gets a level, though. Nice! Okay, cool! The second floor. Are we nearly done here? Surely we can't have many more left. Let's have a little look in the little veranda here, see if there's anything going on. We'll make a little speech. Hello! Download Game of Thrones! Alright. Are we actually going all the way to the... Have we went past where we're supposed to, or are we supposed to go that way? Oh, was I supposed to go in there? I think I was, do you know? I kind of want to fight the other AOA members, should we do it? Maybe check for some items? Or maybe the items will be there after, I don't know. I'll take another fight with Canon Dramon, I think, because I think he's close to leveling. Or at least maybe getting a new move, although he'll probably just load text, I don't know. I think at this point Black War Greymon's actually my best Digimon. Hmm. Gimme, gimme. Gimme. I'm gonna fight this guy. What did he say? Nobody can stop who? Right. Are you considered a dino? Male Dramon? Probably a Dramon, right? You got Dramon. You must be a dragon. My FPS has just went completely to pot here. What is going on? That did no damage. I've been lied to. Why is my game down to 20 FPS? It's so bizarre. My game was running so nicely. I'm wondering if it's just this fight or maybe it's my YouTube tabs. I have no idea. Hmm. Maybe we reboot or something. BRB, I gotta go grab some milk. Bye, Brittany. See you later. Brittany, I'll see you in when I'm 36. In like a hundred years time or whenever. It was nice, <laughs> nice having you here. <laughs> Take it easy, Brittany. Bye bye. I told you scream number two, BWG was great in this game. Listen, Jack, you might have mentioned it once or twice. I'm not really sure. It's all a blur. See you in three years. Bye, Brittany. Bye. <laughs> Take it easy. Alright. We're nearly there, guys. We're nearly there. 
Maybe it's just male Jamon and Kanner Jamon being on the screen at the same time. Is that what's causing the the churning? She may be back. You gotta go through this guy. Oh come on. They must just have really high defense stats in here. Let's try... I mean, honestly, I don't think it matters too much. It's not a dino, not a Dramon, not a fish. We win these. Maybe in, in terms of speed. Just maybe we get two hits on them. Healing's good. It's been a bit of a slow part of the playthrough today, guys. Lots and lots of AoE fights back to back to back, and they're all pretty much the same with a couple of, uh, a little bit of variance. Should be coming up against the boss soon. I'm hoping this gives me level 25 on Mon 1's, uh, Mega here. That should make a big difference. Also, building up some Blast might actually get us through the fight against the boss, so I don't hate that. I'm just sad that we blasted a few times already. 500 XP, 23 on Cannon Dramon. No level 42, unfortunately. Who's past this here? Anything else? Is there any items here? There might be another fight. I'm wondering if we should just ignore it or not. There's gotta be something here. Nope, absolutely nothing. Alright. I think what we do is we just go for it, guys. I think we've got everything we uh, could possibly want for a fight. Part of me thinks that Renamon and Black War Greymon should go first. Although I really want to get some XP on Monmon Mon if I can. MP levels are pretty good. Renamon's probably going to get one-tapped, but if she can get some damage off, it might be worth. Which is why I think we put her in as, like, Digimon 2, maybe. Just lead with Cannon Dramon, try and give him as much XP. Or we could lead with Black War Greymon and try and tear through some ass. And then swap into Monmon. Mon. But that just means that I'm probably going to swap back after healing. Yeah, actually, that's fine. I don't think Agamon's going to one-shot all these bosses. I mean, he might. I do want to put the XP in a Mon Mon. I just worry that Cannon Drummond doesn't have a main move. So he might struggle here, but he's strong, so. Let's go for it, guys. Master Room, we're going in. Fail says save game. Uh oh. Oh, we don't have to do the monster thing again, do we? Please, no. This is weird. There's no one here. Not like this. Never like this. I see, it's the same game as the Asuka Master, it's a secret door. What's the code? Asuka was monster, so maybe it's digital here? <laughs> it opened by itself, why? Maybe it wants me to come in. I wonder why they did that. Like, that, that whole segment is so strange. Maybe they were going to make you do it again, and then they were like, nah. Oh, more fights before the boss, I guess. Got some more trash bags to get through. We've been waiting. You defeated our chiefs. Come on, I'll take on you. On. I'll take you on. We're stronger than anything you've faced yet. With the pride of the royal guard, I'll defeat you. All right, let's see if they're talking, uh, telling the truth here. Nightmon. Hmm. Nightmon, we fought you once before in our past life. Let's see if you've got anything to the. Oh, two hundred eighty-three. That's pretty scary. We block his ass. Good. How would we get through you? I don't think any of this is going to be that great. Try this on the off chance that it's... Uh... Nope. I think we just have to wail on him, guys. I have no idea how much damage he's going to do. At least he has actually taken damage this time. We're going to block him twice. Now he knows how it feels. Soul charge. That better not be a heal. Saving chi. I don't know what that means. I don't know what saving chi means, but we're getting some hits off on him. Is he gonna heal? Please no. Zerk sword. Two hits. Pretty big damage. Um. We've blocked a lot of his main attacks. I'm wondering if we heal here. 
It's just supercharged back up. If he saves Chi, I'll get a couple of hits off on him. And at the very least, we're building up our blast power, so... He looks like he's very slow. This should be good XP for Mon Mon. I don't know if that Berserk Sword was him saving Chi into the charge attack, or if uh, if there's more to it than that. We do get a little baby heal here, which is nice. If I get two attacks in a row, I can maybe kill him here. Oh, that doesn't look like enough. Soul charging. Rosemon special OP. I'm sure that the magic attacks of Renamon would be good, guys. It's just that swapping my Renamon into the fight would be awkward. Um, at this stage, I'm hoping I can just attack him here and finish him. If I have to fight another Nightmon, I'll swap my team out, okay? I think you're probably supposed to use magic to get through that guy, so the fact I'm just wailing against him with my face is probably not ideal, but I really wanted to give XP to Monmon. Mon. I thought if I swapped in Renamon and he one-shots her, she would just die, so... That's based on my playthrough and my knowledge of this team in particular. Monmon Mon level 42 is also something I wanted, because that will give him some stats. For the, uh, for the next main, the main boss. We're fairly healthy as well, which is good. They said they were the Royal Guard. The guy up at the top is ahead. <gasps> they were so useless. I'm rather impressed by your strength, says question mark, question mark, question mark. Who is this guy? Is that the dude out of, um, the Goofy movie? Smokey! Ooh, 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 ooh. President, oh yes. But you can call me Chief Officer. It sounds cooler. Stop kidding around. Terminate Destromon right now. Hey, chill out. Why don't you join us? If you say yes, I'll make you my number two. I don't want to be number two. That's a, that's a shit name. You use e Digimon for evil. Even if I'm destroyed, you'll never be. I'll never be one of you. You just blow your chance. You really are a stupid boy. By the way, it's already too late to change your mind. In we go, guys. Here we go. Metal Seedramon, first up. Kind of a scary fight for us. Not ideal. Let's go for. I mean, I don't think he's a fish type, but we'll try. Probably considered machine. We don't have our limit break yet. Yeah, that's pretty weak. Pretty weak sauce. Let's see how good this guy actually is. He's going to hit us for a decent amount of damage, but nothing too scary, nothing too critical. Let's try Dramon Buster here. Again, it's a bit hopeful to be using these moves, but you never know. Hey, that was better. 400 damage. And we're healing. The vice president of the company, this random 12-year-old. God Bombard. Wait a minute. God Bombardment? Is that what it was called? Oh, that was a lot of damage. I think what we'll do here is we will supercharge. I don't know if he's going to do that to me twice. I don't know if he's programmed to do that to me twice, but healing here certainly wouldn't be a bad thing. I think the recovery crest in this game has been pretty fun. It's been very useful for us. <coughs> I wouldn't necessarily call it OP, but it certainly helps. Oh, we just crit this guy. Nice. Big. That's one down. Venom Iotus one. Speak of the devil. How's it going? He's going to go first. Probably going to have some poison on him, right? I don't want to get poisoned by this guy. Here we got a nice little heal proc here. Going to top us up just gently. If we can get like two or three of those, that's actually a substantial amount. Uh, I'm just going to try Dramon Buster again. See how much damage this does. Not bad. 399 is good. He just laser beam eyes us. I can't tell what kind of damage that is. Can't tell if it's a physical attack or magic. I'm assuming it's a physical attack, but let's do a physical attack of our own. See if this does more than 399. 456. There. I think we're going to blast this fight, you know that? Unless he one shots me, which is possible. Darkness Chaos. That could do a lot of damage potentially. We haven't blasted yet. I think we'll supercharge ourselves. Just top up. This isn't going to take us to full, but we may get a recovery crest proc after it, which might heal us. Yep. I'm going to take a break from the screens. I'll talk to you later. Bye, Blue Crew. Peace, homie. Uh, right, let's just do a physical attack. Seems to be quite good here. I think Venom is a, a magic attacker, maybe, but... Okay, nice. This is going to probably make us blast. A little bit early here, but maybe we're going to full heal as well. Means we're going to go into the last Digimon that he has in blasted form, which I would rather save, but 
I have no idea how powerful this guy is. We're gonna go up to Black War Greymon, I guess. Kind of unusual. Let's just go for a regular hit here. I should kill him. And then from here, we're gonna Terra Force the next guy, whoever the last Digimon is. Let's find out. Raidenmon. Okay. Raidenmon, please don't kill me. Just looking for some blocks here, potentially. A lot of damage taken. Let's try Terra Destroyer, our best bet here. Looks like we can tank another one of those, assuming that it doesn't crit me. So maybe we'll be okay. It's a lot of damage, surely. It's gotta be a lot. 1100. And we're getting the leftover heal actually to keep us alive. That's actually very useful. That might give us... Guys, if we survive on less than 115 HP, then we're hard carried by the recovery crest here. Kind of hoping we defend one of these, maybe. 600. Alright, let's see if we can chunk him. Monmon might be going down here, unfortunately. I don't think there's anything I can do about it. Unless this crits, which it doesn't. We're going to have to block an attack. Or go twice if we're really lucky, but remember when we did the training of speed? I don't know, is that enough? Come on, Monmon. One time, homie. Oh, we get to go first. Uh, what were we doing before we transformed? I don't think we've hit this guy yet, have we? We could tag out. Let's tag out into Sakuyamon. See if I can get away with this. This is mega greedy. I, I strongly suspect this guy's going to one-shot me, but there's every possibility that he doesn't. Let's see. Gilded. Oh, wait, is that a heal? Oh, that looks like a heal, is it? Generating. HP gradually recovers. Oh, that's not good. Let's try Electro Bolt in him first. See how much damage it does. I guess I deserve this. Um, let's go try Black War Greymon. Such a disappointing Digimon, man. Holy shit, dude. I wouldn't matter, like, I wouldn't mind it if she had landed the damage, but, like, holy shit, dude. I'll use a Terror Destroyer here, see how much we can get away with. So annoying. Everybody else is just so reliable, and then there's just Sakuyamon. Sag. Alright. We can go for the finisher, we can revive her. I think we just try and end this before it gets too dicey. There's every possibility we miss here and then he kills me and then he attacks me again to game over us, which is possible, but... We don't consider that alternative timeline. Alright. Bit messy. Looks like Agamon and Monmon are going to share the XP this time. I was trying to get someone Renamon, but alas. I guess until we get some major moves on Sakuyamon, man, I don't know. Like, the fact that she, she throws the electric attack at the machine type Digimon and it just doesn't connect and I'm just like well that is like all of our training wasted in that one moment it's so sad Dino Buster learned I'm pretty sure that's something we already had on Cannon Dramon. yeah I don't know it's so much faster than the last playthrough Raidenmon was a nightmare in that one I think we're just a lot stronger this time around Valkyrie hey wait I'll turn myself in you really are strong I wonder who would win you or him <gasps> Nani? You mean you're not the final boss? Hello? President of Megami, I'm putting you under arrest. Putting? Placing? Hey, everyone. Just give yourself up. We got every one of the AOA except you. Alright, I think I've had enough. Next time, I'll play for myself. Pardon? Oh, he's rather obedient. But there's one more thing. Destramon, you can't stop it with that machine. Oh, you can stop it with that machine. With that machine. You just... Alice! Alice we met the last time we were playing Cult of the Lamb, I think? Okay then, I'll interrogate him. And you guys go stop Destramon, says Lisa. Roger that, yes. Lisa's gonna go interrogate the boss. Oh dearie me. Teddy, hurry up! Destramon's gonna land on a city. Yes, sir. Kind of looked like Deshamon was already landing on a city, to be honest. Teddy, you know how... Hey, well, most of it. 
the system in the same as the oh the system's the same as the Asuka server. We're asking Teddy if he knows what he's doing. Basically, he says it'll be fine. Teddy, let's talk more work. Hold your horses. Alice, how are you today? Welcome. Come on, please be in time. Nice. Oh. Uh oh. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why you don't run solar beam. Uh oh. Surely he didn't have a. Is that his, is that a self destruct sequence? Isn't? Surely it didn't have to be. <laughs> it was a bit overkill. Uh, cinematically very cool for a PS1 game, as we keep pointing out, but uh, do we really have to blow them up like that? We could have maybe like broke them down and sold them or like used them for microwave parts or something. Yeah, we did it! Teddy, you were only supposed to blow the bloody doors off! This Dramon stopped and broke down. We won against the AOA! Yeah, we did it, Teddy! Next, like, Teddy, what did you do, you idiot? Everything went great, you two. I have to go tell the others. I guess. Man, I'm beat, says Teddy. Today just sucked. Don't try and pretend like this was done in a day, Teddy. Nobody's beaten this game in a day. Apart from a chosen few. Really? I had fun. Let's go to the login room. I'm sure everyone uh, and the Matrix Chamber are back to normal. Yeah, let's go back to the real world. Do, 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 do. Imagine Teddy shanked us in the back and it turns out he was the game master all along. Oh, wait a minute. Teddy, something's not right. There's a problem, guys. We've defeated the AOA. We've, we've we've defeated the boss of the AOA, although the boss of the AOA alluded to the fact that there was someone higher up, and also Decimon has been stopped from destroying the real world. But on the way out, we realise, actually, wait a minute. We've defeated these guys, but all the civilians here are still pigs. Literally. It's not even a joke. They're, they're actually Oinkmon. So now we're thinking, wait, can we leave like this? Teddy's like, dude, I don't give a shit. Wolfie, the chamber's not working either. Oh, ho, ho, just when you thought it was over, guys. Just when you thought you had made it to the end of DW2003. This happens. Hey, Wolfie, Teddy. Uh-oh. Kale. Wait, I forgot who you were. Oh, Kale from the start of the game, right? Why won't Kurt turn back to normal? Uh, we defeated the AOA, right? Is Kurt and everyone going to stay this way? Oink. Guys, thank you for the horrific donations against my... <laughs> I'll be telling my mum and dad everything that Dry Frankie and KK Gozain has said about them when I see them next, guys. I'm gonna, I'm not, I'm gonna tell them everything. 11 10 p.m. Alice, what are you gonna do? You've just woken up at 11 p.m. Oh, Alice. No, I'm sure there's a way to turn them back, says Teddy. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Right, Wolfie. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, you guys wait here. I'll go look into it. So. This, guys, is where we realise all is not completely finished yet in the world of Digimon World 3. We've got a new location to go to next. I'm pretty sure... Let's see if, uh, if I can run this by myself memory-wise, or if I can sort my little handy-dandy guide that's been good. I'm pretty sure we have to go to Quinlong, right? Or Kinglong? Yeah. Go to Lisa and Nick twice. Where is Lisa and Nick? Apparently, if we don't talk to Lisa and Nick, it doesn't progress, guys. Maybe I'm wrong. There's only one way to be doubly sure. If we go back and speak to them, it's f it's weird because I think you don't have to talk to them to proc this, but talking to them gives you a clue of where to go next. It's just really weird because the game deliberately puts you outside. Uh, which is, like, super strange. It's like it points you in the wrong direction and says go that way. Maybe, maybe you don't have to speak to these guys and you can just go to Quinlong for the next part of the story, but apparently if you talk to these two, if they're even still in here, I hope they are. Are they here? Oh god, no. Where did they go? I don't know which way they went. Uh, everyone is safe. Talk to Lisa and Nick twice. I don't know where Nick and Lisa are. 
Maybe you don't have to talk to them at all. Are they in the dungeons, maybe? Congrats on the new sleep schedule, lol. I know, Alice, you're going to be pretty doomed. Foo Fighters Pretender. What if I say nothing? Hell yeah. Alice, is that what you're going to do now? You're going to practice some, uh, some learn to fly on the guitar and that's... Is that going to keep you awake, is it? <laughs> All right. Let's go this way. Alice, have you been smoking some ching tonight? <laughs> All right, let's go this way. I don't know where Nick and friends are, but there's a couple of things we can do in the city. We're supposed to go down to Seriu, which is in the Amaterasu server. So again, Kinlong is the name of it. Or something like that. I think when we get down there, we get prompts on what to do next, perhaps. And if I'm wrong, I guess we'll figure that out when we come to it. But I want to go to the laboratory right now and swap into War Greymon. So we have access to that now. We can also have a look at some of the other Digimon that were available. Should be cool. Assuming that the professor is available here and he's not a pig. Oh no, he's the only one who's not a pig, conveniently. I'm certainly not upset about that. I was in the bathroom, he said. Alright, cool. So what we want to do is we want to Digivolve into a different Digimon. Let's get Agamon. And we're going to change it into... We're going to take... let going to take Metal Greymon out, I think. Let's go ahead and take Metal Greymon out and we're going to put in War Greymon. We're going to select him. Uh, I think I can load some other techniques here as well, do we? What better moves have we got now? Unload these. Uh, fire and Black Dart are better, right? And Firefield, I guess. Let's just load these. And then that means when we level up Wargrimon, we can use some attacks. We're going to lose our Terra Force, which is really sad, but... For the most part, we're alright. Do we want to unload Blackthorn? Because I think this is old news now. You can actually keep this tidy and just use these moves from Black War Greymon. Black Dart is going to be better, I think. If we even use any magic attacks at all, that is. Um, yeah, was there any other Digimon we could get here? Oh, he's unlocked Cubimon. Cubimon, for some reason, Agamon's unlocked. Whatever. Let's go ahead and look at Monmon's Digivolutions as well here, really quickly. Uh, we're probably going to take out Hookmon at this point. We now have access to XVmon, Digitamamon, Metal Mammymon, and Greymon, oddly enough. Which is really strange. This guy's got Slowdown, by the way. I've just realised Slowdown on Metal Mammymon. Maybe that's something we could have worked towards loading, potentially. Maybe even something we could put in, but I think we're fine. Wingbuster, Bugbuster, Cannonjumon has Fish and Dino, so we don't actually have to load those anymore. We can unload those from Armormon. Let's go into load technique. Armormon, we don't have to load those anymore. So Dino and Fish, <clears throat> we don't need because Cannon Drummond has those. He's got Drummond and then Wing and Bug. He should learn something new soon, hopefully. He's level 25. I hope he's getting a new move soon. But that'll do. Uh, lastly, Sakuyamon. Let's have a look at her Digivolution options because I think we got some new stuff here. We've now got access to Anjuman, Stingmon, Cubimon was unlocked earlier, Growmon, Digitamamon, and Devimon. Very cool. This is Wolfie High. Uh, yeah. Hell yeah. Are we going over? That's good. I can take my laptop and I can finish the thing. Uh, yeah, I'll be I'll be done shortly anyway. We're wrapping things up. Thank you, Mrs. Wilfie. Nice one. <clears throat> Alright. Do we want to swap out any I mean Devimon's kinda cool. It's not Lady Devimon, it's regular Devimon. Bit unusual, but cool. Uh let's go ahead and load some techniques here on Sakuyamon, just make sure because she's got ac access to Snowstorm and Electro Bolt, which means we don't actually need to load that on Talmon anymore anymore. We're going to unload this, just keep it nice and tidy. And uh, that's it. Grand Wave's still useful, of course. I feel bad, man. Like, I know <clears throat> some of you guys have told me throughout the playthrough. Dumpster's told me this. I've had some comments about it and stuff about the, the defensive Renamon. I know it's something that, like, you know, when she keeps getting one shot and I keep acting annoyed about it, it's like, well, you're just doing the same thing over and over, dude. Like, it's always going to keep happening. It's just a really hard... Um, <clears throat> It's a, it's a weird one of like a weird balance to trend because obviously Renamon 
needs speed, right? I think that's a given. She needs magic damage and spirit. That's a given. And she needs um, accuracy. If I was to train defense as well, that's like a fourth thing to train. So at that point, you're just training all of the character. The only thing you wouldn't train is physical strength, right? And then maybe some of the resistances. It's a tough one. So Quinlong is where we're supposed to go. That's nice and easy because it's just down the road from us in-game. But uh, I'm worried that I get there and then I have to come back up. I guess at the end of the day, it wouldn't be a massive problem if that was the case. All right, that's fine, guys. Lots of training today, lots of mindless battles. The only problem with this part of the game when you're fighting the AoA guys, first of all, I fought way more AoA than we were supposed to. I fought like the extra fights, done all the extra stuff. You can definitely ignore some of those fights if you don't want anything to do with them and feel totally fine about it. Uh, but I was trying to get some XP, we are trying to grind, and obviously the, the fights against the AoA give you more XP than just random encounters, so why not just one-shot those enemies like Maeldramon and get fast XP, right? But uh, sorry that segment took so long, hopefully I'll be able to streamline this and edit in later and smooth it out as best I can. I'm going to be fusing this today's stream with Thursday's stream and making episode 7 with that, so if you guys have been enjoying that, thank you so much. Um, this is probably a good place to wrap up, folks. The day was only supposed to be a small stream for me and I'm going, I've just been informed that we might be going out for dinner with, or at least going over to see my family for dinner tonight. I'm not sure what the plans are, but the, I've just been informed of that. So that makes this a pretty successful Saturday all in all. And I hope you guys have enjoyed. I'm going to wrap up my VOD first and then I'll talk to the live stream guys afterwards. So if you guys have watched this part of the playthrough, guys, if you have made it this far, seven episodes deep into Digimon World 2003, I think. Uh, unless I'm much mistaken, I think this is two, I think this is episode seven. Thank you so much for watching. Definitely leave me a like if you're here. If you're looking for the next episode, I'll try and put it like up here somewhere on the screen. We made a lot of progress today. We got a lot of Digivolutions, done a lot of training. We're definitely into that late game grind of Digimon World Three, where the Digivolutions start being slower to level. The Digimons, you know, you're getting less exciting moves. You're getting to that late game point where you just have to put time in. So there's a lot more grinding. There's a lot more getting lost, of course, as you've seen. I've tried my best to make that as entertaining as possible for you guys by giving you little bits and bobs of the live streams. Let me know your thoughts if you've been enjoying it. If you're playing through your own playthrough of Digimon World 3 right now, let me know your uh, your uh, opinions on how your playthrough is going and if you're having fun. And uh, we'll be wrapping this up soon. We've managed to defeat some big bosses today, so when we come back, we'll be tidying up some other stuff. And then we'll be on to the post game, I believe. Check it out next time, guys. See you later. Bye-bye.